Uh. Yeah, is, uh, there we go. The freestyle <laughs> by Corey Holcomb and this bitch. Because I don't like your daughter, bitch. <laughs> I don't like your daughter, bitch. Ever since I saw the little hoe, niggas knocking on my motherfucking door. <laughs> it's Trina there. Is she coming out? I say, hey, put that thing in that bitch mouth. Cause I don't like your daughter, bitch. <laughs> Going in my refrigerator. Every nigga that nut in her, somehow they hate her. Oh. Her two kids that she kept because she thought them dudes was going to give a fuck. <laughs> but then they ducked out on her ass. <laughs> fuck that silly slut. Even though that bitch do got a big ass butt. But I won't fuck her though. Because it's your daughter. So get the daughter out of my face before the slaughter. I don't like your daughter, bitch. I told you he has some shit. Let me see. It don't matter. We got a dilemma on our hands. Yo. Yep. Motherfucker. Fuck it, give me that motherfucker. Nigga, I was just gonna go downstairs to the bar. Oh. You really would go to the bar to open this motherfucker? Man, them white boys do what I tell them to. (laughs) Good evening, everyone. (laughs) I done bought enough barbecue over there. What up, 5150 Nation? We have returned. Um, Yes. God damn, what's up, (laughs) Dayton? That was a crazy-ass weekend. I almost went to jail in that motherfucker. Oh, Oh, shit. Man, I went in this store in the Dayton Mall. Man, this motherfucker, uh, aggressive motherfucker in this store. I can't. I don't even remember the store. It was the black store mm-hmm. to sell the black shit. And the dude at the counter was talking crazy like a motherfucker. Really? I to you or to someone else? Well, he was mainly talking to me, if you ask me, because I think somebody said he a comedian or something. It made that motherfucker want to try me. Really? Man, I, I was get- like... Is he? Ta- you know, at the wild, well, you be like, "Who are you talking to?" <laughs> Is he talking to me? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was going to jail. I had gave oh. my homeboy my cell phone to there. Oh he shit! Was a, he was a. Uh, I, I, didn't, I didn't hit him. I was. I wanted to stick his ass. <laughs> Wait, he you worked there. Look at that eye. I was looking at that eye, and I kept trying to walk away. That's the only reason I didn't go to jail because the, they had a videotape of what happened. Oh yeah. Store. Oh shoot! You're gonna end up like To, but To handled it. Yeah, I don't give a fuck if they show that videotape. That motherfucker kept saying threatening shit. He was on what the did phone he say? like, "You'll get yours." Wait, like, what, what happened? What'd you do? So I you was looking the phone at it out his hand like, "Blah!" <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you going to jail, you motherfucker? I was like, "Oh, you." Wait, pussy what motherfucker. started it? So you not being clear. You slapped- it, start, it started by him talking crazy in the store. He first he was yelling at the employees. I ain't give a fuck. I don't know them, but then oh. I'm talking to the employee. He come over to the employee while I'm talking to the employee and just start yelling at the motherfucker. I'm like, man, you act like mm. you're no customer in the motherfucking store. Mm. After he said slick shit before. He worked there? It was, he was, it, he, it was his store. Oh, hell. So man. that, mm. look, everybody from Dayton know what I'm talking about. The little uh, Armenian man <laughs> at the Dayton Mall, bitch ass motherfucker called the cops after he was talking shit. He was acting like he was hard. Mm. That shit got me excited and shit. I was like, <laughs> and then you oh, slapped the motherfucking yeah, phone out his I should have stuck him. I would have paid my bill, but I had a show that night. I, I, before I knew it, the phone was knocked out oh his head, but I wanted him to, because he was acting like he was going to do stuff. I was like, blah, what, motherfucker? Oh. Yeah, let me cool out. That shit got oh, me excited. Oh, my God. Oregon, all Mac- Look at this. Yeah, that police officer came out of there. He was like, you knocked that phone out of his head. But he, I could tell you kept trying to leave. But he kept saying something that made you so come back. So he watched the video. They watched the video. Uh, video is everything now. Oh, yeah. He, he could have took me to jail, though. But, I could have missed that last show on Sunday night. But he looked out. But remember, he was not. Like, I'm a, just go. <clears throat> y'all got to lead them all. That's what he said. You got to lead oh, them okay. all, man. He's like, but. Uh, <laughs> was it a brother? No, it was a white cop. Well, all right. Oh, really? A uh, real one. Caucasian cop, too. Look, look really? Out. You didn't get but, his name? You could have gave him a shout out. I didn't get his name, but look. Look, look. This is why I say, in a race, everybody ain't one thing. You see right, what I'm saying? Right, 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 right. I mean, I feel like Caucasian people do a lot of crooked shit, and they are the cause of a lot of crooked shit. Right. But. He looked out. Confident mm-hmm. men are he confident happened. men. He saw yeah. what happened. He was like, yeah. I saw it. He kept saying something. He was yeah. getting ready to leave, but he kept on saying shit. And I was like, yeah, he was threatening me. He was acting tough. Like, he better get on the phone and set some shit up. He's mm. like, but you knocked that phone he out. Was, he head, said, but you, you <laughs> hit. You hit. <laughs> That's good take a hit. Yeah. 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 So I'm glad I didn't go to jail. Yeah. Yeah. That, 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 that puss-ass 
Store in that mall. <laughs> what kind of store was it? Just, just, just store to sell ghetto shit that I wear, like Robin's jeans. Oh, gear. Jeans but it was a gear. Like, okay. Yeah, I, okay. He had his Robin's jeans roped off. <gasps> he really? Yeah, yeah. Like, That's you hilarious. can't go over there. He don't what? trust niggas. I'm like, the shit right here. Yeah, he don't trust niggas. <laughs> but I still was like, try to be cool, man. But that yelling and shit, no. man, I'm like, man, you ain't no gangster. Shut the fuck up. And he mm. must be used to yelling at black people. Yeah. Well, no, the workers were all Indian dudes. Those. You know what? Them motherfuckers. It was all Indian. Wait, do the accent. Wait, what? <laughs> what the? <laughs> it Big gulp. Bingo, you bingo. stop it. <laughs> this nigga right here. What, they say bingo. Well, he was Armenian. He was a very aggressive man. Uh, Uh-oh. Act like he was tough than a motherfucker. Until that's that's what I was like, yeah, <laughs> okay, you tough motherfucker. <laughs> right. So, thank you, Dayton Police. All right. Officer, okay. whoever you are. All right. Because you With sure could have walked me up out that motherfucker. Up. No, they had the mall cops. The mall cops just was around uh, until the real cops showed up. You what? know that? They Damn. was like, hey, man. Um, oh. Take it easy. You're right, guy. I know Come you're on. black. Shit. You're upset. You know, I know you want those jeans. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Free love, ain't it? Free love to show up in this <laughs> What up, boy? Like that Cubs, is that? Yeah, man. I like that. That's what's up. Yeah. yeah. That's tight. That's what's, what's up, up? We all there, nigga. <laughs> it's live. He don't care. He like, he I say hi. Who we all at, baby? Yeah, we used to talk about. Uh, um, Corey had a little bit of an altercation, and he well, got it. No, he, he. I was for the lie. I was for the lie and say, uh, <laughs> "Why the Corey fuck am I slapping people?" I was for the say, "Zoe slapped man. the shit out of this nigga." <laughs> I just wanted to see Freeze, see what happened. Oh, I would be like, "Why are you still doing this?" Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all don't know Zoe like I don't. Hey man, I believe you if you say it. If Zoe, Zoe, Zoe gangster. Okay, I don't believe you no gangster. I'm just saying. I, I believe Zoe. Huh. Zoe probably had a temper. You know, I'm gonna be so smart. When you go to the pen, you know what you do? Read. Zo, you been to the pen? I've never been to the pen. I knew you ain't been to the pen. <laughs> I know a pen, nigga. A pen, nigga, always look like this. Shit, bullshit. Nope. <laughs> they look dazed. Look, there's always one pen, dude, that the people, we always like, hey, man, what, what's my situation? They, they know all the law. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's him. <laughs> well, brother. Zoe ain't never been to the pen. Nah, the pen takes been something been. from you, dog. He hasn't been to the pen, but yeah. it's a miracle. Chris ain't never been to the pen, Darlene. Nobody in here been to the pen, really. I've never really. been to the pen either. Never. I can tell you ain't been to the pen. Never. I've been to jail. The, the, the jail. army, <laughs> army, probably yeah. lock up for a couple of days. Stockade, I know how that, that go. All of that. That's part of it. When I was locked up, man, not locked up like I did time. I ain't never did no time. Right. I'm but saying, but when I went to jail, it right. was so funny. I went to jail in Florida. Oh. Down there at the spring break oh, shit. shit. We used to go down there and sell the fake gold chains to the Vicks. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? The, right. the little white boys and shit. Right. Who like, how much, man? By the chain on Friday. <laughs> right. On Sunday, they neck be they green. They neck green in the motherfucker, bro. <laughs> hey, I've been looking for you. Right. <laughs> oh, they, oh boy, what I, boy, you just don't know. But anyway, man. we went to jail because we got mm. caught. Our what, dumb ass. <laughs> man, we was on the Florida. beach selling gold chains. The police was like, and you weren't Jamaican. This ain't, this ain't free. <laughs> that police officer, he was white too. He said, you think we finna let y'all come down here and work these vicks on the beach? <laughs> he was like, get Bring the fuck out of here. <laughs> so they had us locked yeah. up, right? And they, they keep you in there for about 12 hours because they know it's some bullshit. Right. Enough mm-hmm. to piss you off. Yeah. Right. Enough to make you say, I'm, I'm not here. doing this again. Right. right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but it was this big black dude came in there and he was mad and he hit the wall he said, boom, he hit that wall hard. He said, he said no motherfucker better not say shit to me. And I just couldn't help it. I said, what? Oh, <laughs> my God. I couldn't help it. I Dude. couldn't help it. Huh? Oh, I probably could have got my ass whooped. But What'd you as say? As soon as I said, <laughs> what? That nigga no. said, I ain't talking to you, homie. I was like, oh, exactly. okay, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Put two and two together. If you just hit the wall, you're not hitting nobody else. Right. Wall, <laughs> what Bruce Lee say? Walls don't hit back. What did he say? <laughs> Boards don't, Boards hit, don't back. hit back. I ain't going to lie, but I was young. 
I was in college, nigga. I was playing ball. I was kind of cut up then. Yeah. I ain't know that, nigga. Young, I, you know that fear of being scared is something you don't know. But at right. the same time, nigga, you ain't finna come in here and check me. Uh-huh. And we wasn't in no jail cell. Right. What we was at in Florida, they had us outside in cages, man. What? We was outside in cages. The shit on the beach. That's how I knew I wasn't finna do no real time. I'm like, man, they got this little outdoor jail set up. Cages? Like, so cages so like so animals. Got, so if you guys wanted to, all you guys could have got together and picked up the <laughs> Well, we couldn't get up under that cage, Damn but it was it. like everybody who was looking over there at the cages, yeah. we was over there. It was to humiliate you. you yeah. They could see you. Hey, I, could but see I, I us. were walking by there. and could see y'all. No, it wasn't right on oh, the beach. It was all to the God. side. But a nosy motherfucker would be like, what's that? <laughs> that's the, it's oh, like that's a jail. It's a nigger kennel. They took this white boy. To, <laughs> this white boy was down there in jail because he had the fake ID. He had made a fake ID. Oh, he was on that. He had the felony. I didn't know yeah, that shit was real like that. He had them uh, felony yeah. colors. When you go into with the, that important yeah. shit, that motherfucker was looking scared than a motherfucker. Mm-hmm. I was like, boy, you going to county? He was one of them real. White boys, Aww. polo sweater. Hey, fellas, you mind if I can that have guy, some of that wanna, coffee? <laughs> right. Remember they were singing on trading places in that group? Right. What was the name of that group? He was in. Oh. Well, they was acting funny with him. Oh, um, I got that shit. <laughs> <laughs> one, of, one of them looking white boys. Boy, oh. I was like, you better go to county? Boy, they about to wear that asshole out. <laughs> Damn. I remember that scene. That was the funniest with the little with the little sweaters tied around the neck. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's what right. I'm talking about. That's how he looked. He was in jail. He was like, he, was like with. he just looked so sad. He was like, fuck. Like, I got caught. <laughs> I'm in here with these niggers. Man, <laughs> it's impossible outdoors. to have a good conversation. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's vocabulary here is just. <laughs> can, I, can I speak to my attorney? When, I, when do I get my call? <laughs> it's a comedian named Tyler in Atlanta. Oh, yeah. I know Tyler. Tyler, Tyler funny as hell. Tyler funny to the yeah. motherfucker. When Skull was alive, uh, it's this little puss ass comic named um, Ray. Um, <laughs> Ray. Ray. Just Ray? We'll just call him Ray. Ray. Puss, a little puss ass comic. Ass, yeah, <laughs> little white boy. He do whole shit. Uh-oh. Do okay. everybody jokes and then play the white guard. White card uh, when drama come. Yeah. Hey man, it's, it's, this is camaraderie. I'm, right. I'm doing this out of honor, man. I'm paying <laughs> tribute to you, homage to you by saying your stuff. Right. Imitation is the highest form of flattery. Exactly. Man. But Tyler Craig said the funniest <laughs> shit because Sko let him stay down there at his crib. You know, Sko look out for some of the comics when they when he was alive and he had his crib. Uh, but uh, Tyler was knocking on the door. He was knocking on the door. He was like, Sko, open the door. Sko. <laughs> Sko, we want to fuck the white boy, too. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Tyler's stupid. Did him up. <laughs> Tyler, oh my funny, God. man. It's wrong. I give him yeah, props, no. man. No, Tyler funny. I give him props, because I was in Brooklyn. <laughs> I seen a lot of people. You know, Brooklyn, is a, that's a hard crowd. When I first went out there from yeah, L.A., mm. I was, they thought they was going to give me the blues. I'm like, my man. I've done I've done uh, Mavericks Flats. I've Ooh, done I've done the shit. Comedy Act. I've five done five seven in Atlanta. T- man, I've done. Remember that? Which what is one? one? Five five seven oh. in Atlanta. The worst Ooh. crowd ever because <laughs> they come to boo. They come and they is and they very very southern like that little little punk right. puss ass nigga right. gonna say come here boy right. you can't understand <laughs> nigga when you talking shit. They used to love I'm Bruce Bruce. 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 Keep on you. Bruce Bruce what? was the host. Yeah. So they let him go up there and talk shit. But Bruce Bruce just played that music and had him That's country it. motherfuckers bouncing. They was in there yeah. like, yeah, man. Bruce Bruce had them bits when he had them niggas in there. They were loving it. Then he'd be like, okay, I'm about to bring this next motherfucker. <laughs> Might as well be man. throwing them to the Lions, dog. You have to fight for yours. But hey, fuck that. That's I like that, though. That just makes sense. Oh, you like strong. that challenge? Yeah, huh? because, because it separates the suckers from the real comedians. Yeah. Because you know what I'm saying. There'd be a lot of dudes get up there that, that had a name. They'd be like, hey, been blow. he's done this. He's done that. He's the main man. And then they get up there and they be cricket. Mm. Hey, Freeze, I was in Atlanta off a of buddy pass. I didn't even know Bruce Bruce back then. Mm. I said, man, look, I'm down here on a buddy pass and the airline lost my coat. It was cold out there. He was like, you bullshit. <laughs> he looked me up and down. He said, come on, you can go up. That's- man, look. You know, he didn't know me. He didn't know what was going to happen. He thought I was going to bomb. That's why I love Bruce Bruce. He he probably don't even remember that shit. 
But I needed that money he gave me. It wasn't mm. number three hundred and fifty dollars, but it might as well Man. been Life three thousand dollars mm. back exactly. then. Mm. You know what I mean? Exactly. Mm. Man, I went up there, man. Look, I ain't trying to brag, but I rocked it. Yeah. Them niggas had never seen no shit like me before. <laughs> and that's, that's what they be wanting. They were, they don't, a lot of people go and they try to adapt to them. They don't want that because you can't adapt to them. You're not them. You better be you. Right. It's, yeah, it was, you know, back then when, when the street money was heavy, it was them people. Mm -hmm. That's what it was. But if you're a man... Even if, like, they, everybody respect the man, especially the motherfuckers who come from that. They'll be like, man, this nigga trying to do some comedy. You know what I mean? But right. there be some motherfuckers up there who just ain't got it. And mm -hmm. I don't know why they in the game. Them motherfuckers still do comedy to this day. Oh, I know, uh. few, I know several. You be uh. wanting like, to say, man, why do you why? do this shit? Why you never you? hit a lick. Have you ever tried painting? Right. You're probably a hell of an artist. <laughs> and you don't even know. Right. You know? Because I, I, love, I love comedy, and I'll go. Often to a lot of these shows out here, and we'll see them, and we'll go, oh god, there's that guy again. Well, I might as well go to the bathroom. But I'm not kidding. Like we're just like, oh, what? You wonder how they get on shows, don't you? I, I call them fillers. Like they're just filling the space to get fillers. to like who's gonna, yeah. And then you'll see somebody walking. You're like, oh, so and so's here. Okay, let's hang out. Let's stay. Let's stay. You know, but, like you know what I would tell you. I seen uh, Honest John. Remember, I, you know, yeah, Honest, I know John. Honest John, the old old white, white dude, dude. Mm -hmm. talks about weed. Let me tell you, Honest John used to bite it. Used to used to. Man, he used to bomb hard. And I don't mean once, twice. I mean years. <laughs> Every time I see him, this dude was bombing. Was that his stick? No, it was, he was really trying. But it was not popping. And I was just like, man, why doesn't this dude stop? But he got strong. And then one day, when it happened, I, I witnessed it. It was some, some sisters in the front row. And it was, you know, fine and everything. He says... Wow, I just look at you black ladies and I think of the, I think of In Vogue. They said, oh, thank you, thank you. He said, we look like In Vogue. He said, no, no, I don't, I don't mean you look like In Vogue. I just think of the song, you know. Never gonna get it, never gonna get it. <laughs> Yo, never <laughs> gonna get it. It blew up, didn't it? around. Yeah, and, yeah. and I've never seen him bomb since that night. Aww. Yeah, because I, I, I only know him from being a seasoned comic. Yeah. He's good. Honest John, Very he's good. an old white man. Look like he's straight from the country. When I, when he get up there, don't look like it's gonna go well. <laughs> but he, he had it. jokes. Yeah, mm. he earned that. He he fought. You I know, see so potential in people when you like. Oh, he'll be better one day. Yeah. Uh -huh. But some people, I just be wanting to go. Man, homie, yeah. why are you, you? You still joke. You cluttering the game. You man. come up here. You do a little <laughs> punk ass dance. Not the clutter. With the with the prop or something like. And not even and, that. D. Uh -huh. What they do? Like they see seasoned comics selling CDs after the show. Mm -hmm. They fucked the CD game mm -hmm. up because too many garbage motherfuckers was selling CDs. Uh. And a motherfucker be drunk and buy a CD and then come oh. back the next. Man, I bought one of them pussy ass CDs. <laughs> Do that thing. motherfucker at my wife. Right. It was a rip off. <laughs> right. <laughs> them CDs is a rip off. I ain't going to even say who, who used to do this. It's this comic out of Houston. And hold on. This motherfucker is funny. Okay. This is the funniest Why you say Hispanic that? comic I ever saw. Okay. Uh-oh. Out of Houston, Texas. The funniest Hispanic comic I ever saw is out of Houston, Texas. Hmm. But he's a motherfucking gangster. Oh. Uh, oh, I and know he, exactly who you're talking so, about. And he used to sell people yeah. blank CDs. <laughs> <laughs> you dirty I motherfucker. I know you're talking about. Why the Juan Villarreal? Yeah. Juan That's my nigga. Yeah. I didn't say that. Hey, I said it. That's the homie. Fuck that, nigga. That's you it. know you grimy. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> he is man, funny Man, ain't that motherfucker. Man, I watch funny. that motherfucker. I'll be like, man, I can't believe the world don't know about this motherfucker right here. Guys, this man. motherfucker is, he used to go up in black rooms, hood shit, rocket. Kill him. Kill man. him. Yo, Somebody man. told what me Miss Sia it? had him on tour with him. I'm like, how the fuck Miss Sia gonna go up after they see that motherfucker? Yo, what? he's no joke. He did a show with me and Charlie in um, Odessa, Texas. What, what, Odessa. Why, why isn't he made that? Why isn't it? <laughs> because he rolls with his sons. His sons. When you see his sons, you be like, room. who the fuck is these motherfucking like, oh, shit, TV killer motherfuckers? What? <laughs> You don't even believe that. scared of him. But he, the reality is, the reality is, there's a lot. Of, like, a lot of people oh, no. scared of yeah, me. Yeah. A lot of people scared of Corey. If you're a man about yourself, 
a lot of people just instantly they get scared and they yeah. I won't be booking him. He, he'll come in here and slap the pocket change out of my mouth. Now, one a man. He 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 he'll walk up to any motherfucker, exactly. talk to him straight up because that motherfucker. He, he, I ain't got to say it. You if you ever meet him, you'll see it. I, I man. Just like downtown Tony Brown in Detroit. Another motherfucker, Nothing. you can't believe he never made it. One of the best mm. comics i ever seen. Mm. So many, man. See them Freddie dude, Riggs, I, Kenny Williams. Freddie Riggs. Mm. Like, I, I think I said that on the show one you day. Said Freddie? Like, you it's, it's a lot of comics who do these characters mm-hmm. while they're on stage. Mm-hmm. And you be like, okay. But when you see Freddie Ricks, you be like, that's where they got that shit from. Yeah, uh-huh. A lot of people chipped that's off what they, homie, man. That's where they got that bullshit from. Freddie Ricks. Mm. Mm. Freddie mm-hmm. One love, Freddie Ricks. Freddie Ricks was running for Congress or some shit. Whoa, whoa, was he running whoa. running for some type of what? What is the motherfucker? He was running for something. I don't. I don't know. The he councilman called me. Or something. Yeah, he called me and shit, man. I ain't. I was running, Freddie. I ain't, I was busy, man. I, I got love for you. That's the friend. <laughs> I didn't hit him back. You know what's up? He, he ain't tripping. Right, He's not no, I know he know what's up, man. Freddie, man, when I, I was I drove from Chicago to motherfucking New York, head gasket blew on the car. Uh. As soon as I got to Jersey. Head crack. And then you know how they just fix it up where to hit the road and make it as long as you don't go real fast? Uh-huh. Yeah. That nigga Freddie Rick say, nigga, look, from here to Cleveland, I got that ass. If you break down, I'll come get you. I never forgot that shit. Wow. Because I know he wasn't lying. He oh, wasn't. Man, this motherfucker. Freddie, that, when I was when we first moved out there, he was one of the, the only comics that really, I, I physically saw him give a lot of dudes breaks. When they would be from out of town, yeah, he was like, "Look, man, I already know they're gonna stonewall your ass, but I tell you what, come on down, I got a buck." For you. <laughs> <laughs> it's always real at that sharp. Jamaican spot in Queens. Uh, what was the name of it? Footprints. Yeah, man, y'all yeah, yeah, for make me laugh. If you don't make me laugh, make one bumble claw your ass. <laughs> no joke. Oh, they, hey, they had that. If you funny, no. What was funny? the name of that spot in, in Footprints? Footprints. Is that no, where they had that? You thinking of squads? No, he had another spot where they had this food. <laughs> they had this shit called Rasta Pasta. Oh, shit. Oh, you thinking of fucking, um, oh, man, uh, out in Manhattan, Coney Island. Manhattan Proppers? No, Manhattan no. Proppers is in Queens. Um, man, I know which one. Damn. Freddie Ricks had this room, Yo. dog. That food, <laughs> that food was so bomb. The room was little as hell. Motherfucker just stand up and watch your ass yep. while they order their food. Man, Whoa. if you're not funny though, uh, if you're not funny, Jamaican, <laughs> them Jamaican motherfuckers are. Hey, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. If I say something funny, <laughs> <laughs> that's how they do it. Oh, uh, yeah, you you don't make me laugh. <laughs> and me, they be like, yo, Spanish man, <laughs> right. Spanish man. Why you keep saying you're black man? You know, black man. I'm not a black man. You are Spanish man. Admit to it. <laughs> <laughs> that's that New York shit, yo. That's how they talk. And look, I be in New York. I hear the motherfuckers yelling and shit while the comedians on stage. I be oh, like, damn, don't am care. I gonna make it? Yeah, but you because <laughs> they ain't playing. They're not. But it, when, when you when you rock it, what happened when you rock it? Start throwing twenties. They show they show you big love. Up, blow, 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 blow. Yeah, man, fire funny man. Yo, yeah, big man. Make that sound again. Blow, blow. Right, they was doing that shit while I was on stage. I didn't know what it was. I thought they was trying to interrupt my set. They was like, no, they like you. Keep going, nigga. I turned the room around. They was on me, and it was a skinny Jamaican chick. She said, yeah, big man, you have to say something funny. I want my money back. I said, young young lady, you look like a 13-year-old boy playing with his mother's wig. Oh. They looked at her. (laughs) (laughs) at first they was like don't talk about the jamaican they they was like damn i'm on a scriber to a (laughs) t he got that jamaican shit dog (laughs) (laughs) big up one love man oh god jesus that's how they talk. Oh, God, I can't. Anyway, yeah. we're going to get it cracking, D. All right, all right. This, all is, a, good. this is a portion of the show good. that um, we have um, <sighs> decided to call it D's nope. Loose talk, talk About Bullshit. Yes. yes, thank you. And and like it is called, it is just loose talk about bullshit. So a, remind, <laughs> a reminder to those that are fairly new to the show. We've, we've been doing this for well, quite a The Z's are going already. Go ahead. What they say go, to D right now? Go, go, 
ahead, go <laughs> ahead. Jamaican motherfucker. Oh, say, yeah, yeah, you talk, you have to talk faster, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, I might get weary when I have to listen. You have to it to the point now. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, and don't get and don't get suggestions. It's really not supposed to be anything serious. Don't get suggestions. So anyway, all right. Over the weekend, or last week, there was a couple incidences that happened. First one that a lot of people are talking about is Miko Grimes. And Miko Grimes is the wife of Brent Grimes, who is a cornerback on the Miami Dolphins. Um, there she is. Ooh, makeup does. They're going to put a picture Ooh. on her? We got a picture of her. Now, mind you, this was after she was arrested. Um, apparently, she's... Got a radio station there, too, and she's not one to mince on her words. Wait, she's married to an NFL player? Yes, but if you see... She got on his wait, jersey. Though, wait, in the, if, in the you see, shot. if you look right. her up, if you go images on Google, you'll see, of course, a lot of these girls, they get themselves all dolled up. Wait. That's how they look without the... But stuff. no, wait, wait, wait. Mm -hmm. Okay, they, love is love. What the fuck you gonna say about that? But do you see though. how that head made in the middle? But can I, I was just <laughs> thinking about that. That motherfucker got an easy button that's been bleached. Oh, wow. oh, 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 oh my god! She got Ambi on her easy button. Damn. Anyway, she's been Ambi. She has been known to not mince on her words. Uh, apparently, she always tweets, and ever since the the husband or the guy she's married to, Brent Grimes, has been in the NFL. She has always spoke very blunt. And to me, kind of out of her pocket, out of her way as a wife, saying a lot of stuff about stuff he should do, the team should do, the coaches. She's uh, got a radio show, and she's always talking about the NFL. Out of she's control, like, bitch. Well, there you go. Anyway, mm. so what happened was she was trying to get through an area that was blocked, and they warned her to stop, you know, because everybody else was being blocked from going through this area, and she was like, Psh. You know, whatever, because a lot of people have it on videotape. She went through. They warned her to stop. She didn't, so they tased her. Then they arrested her. Uh, mm. She was giving them. They have it on. A lot of people were videotaping this. Um, I gave you two photos. Did you post that other one up? There was one where the female cop was, like, you know, holding her down. Um, but apparently, so they arrested her. Arrested her. Um, and so, of course, she went on to say a bunch of other stuff after that. Uh, but apparently, like I said, she's known to say a lot of things she tweets uh her you know speaks her mind about the team and things they should he should do do you know that she actually during breaks in the game she'll actually send him a message on what she thinks should happen so she run that nigga <laughs> Yes. Why the fuck what you, you should do is to take it up the middle, nigga. Right. Just go on up the middle and hit that left button hook yeah. why would you be listening to your wife while you at work man and she ain't never played football like, I'm not trying to talk huh, shit. I'm uh -huh. saying, like, if I played in the NFL and my wife was texting me about that shit, I know me. My wife has texted me during the show. That's why she don't watch it no more, because she mad. Because <laughs> that shut the fuck up is coming. <laughs> but, yo, I don't know. Maybe he's seen her do some shit with that head, like, crush. Oh, well, what's funny, you're speaking can. about the head, but it a wasn't the front. So, yeah. Yeah. Ah, when they were and that's going to be your finger. Her, right? So, when they were trying to subdue her, she headbutted when she went. Oh, so she did back. use so that head. The they had a weapon. Not with the front. <laughs> she headbutted with the back as the, the cop was holding her. Really? So she got the OC. The ball mm -hmm. peen action. Well, <laughs> it said, uh, anyway, they said last year a fan uh, gave some, fans were giving, uh, criticizing him about after a game, and she suggested um, through Twitter, well, my husband might not be around to see the back end of the four-year, $32 million contract he signed. Why did she say that? So she just, she just talking hella shit. out of pocket. Just ratchet. Just talking. Out of pocket, But boy. the pussy must be doing something to this motherfucker. Because why the fuck do you have a motherfucker that talk crazy to you? <laughs> well, some other people are suggesting, and this is just here to say something. In other public. Right. Take so, it up the middle, nigga. <laughs> but you know we don't get along. Stay on. <laughs> right. Some, some people are saying that uh, since she has this show, and apparently she speaks, like I said, she's very blunt and out there, that she's trying to get a reality show and that she's been doing some pretty wild oh, okay. things lately. So she's trying. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, so Hey, we know who she is now. Yeah, there's, there you go. Right. Good one. She's see, so she Congratulations. Did that. Big go. head. Big head. Uh -huh. So uh, another but, thing but that I is, hope they get, let you wear a bang in the police station. <laughs> yeah, they gonna make her wear yeah, a bang, comb. Right. and you put a bang on before you right. bust one of these bars <laughs> open. Right, so, brick wall. Like, that you can't peep through the. 
bars at the sale, goddammit. You can't see number was in front. So another, um, no, speaking no. of um, <laughs> a- athletes, well, not the wives, but this uh, Derek Rose. Uh, I don't know if you know that the last two years he's had a woman. They have named her Jan- Jane Doe because they're not going to give her her uh, name away yet. Um, and so he's been fighting this sexual assault and civil lawsuit case from this woman. Um, she claims that he and two of his friends gang raped her um, two years ago. And then he, uh, nobody's brought anything up until lately because it's going back to court. It's going in court. And they had media day for the Bulls. So, of course, the media was going to ask him right away, like, hey, what's up with this this case? Did you take the pussy from the bitch? So he's saying, no, he, they're admitting, oh, yeah, we all went over there, but it was planned. She let us in. We have the proof. So he's saying, he's saying that this is actually motivation for the new season. Watch out, even though he's injured right now and he has to have surgery because he got elbowed in the face and they broke something in his face. So uh, now uh, they have to have, there. So now uh, he has, so that was the first practice. Fracture. First practice, he got injured. He has to have surgery this Wednesday. But he's saying that he's going to be back and that this is just motivation oh. because it is not true that they did that, raped her, but they did, it did happen. He's saying that it was all planned. He has proof that they um, orchestrated it. She planned. She had them all three come over, he and two of his buddies, and that she said that they, he has proof that she said that she uses a particular toy. You know what and they so call she that? ordered. In Chicago? What? She has set out peace for the folks. Okay. There you, go. you know what? <laughs> That's what she is. She has set out peace. Set out peace for the folks. You know what? Wow. That's what she is. <laughs> Like that he fruit. went over there with the mob. Hello, gentlemen. Please lie your coats over here. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. And so, relax. So they're bust, saying, bust down for chief, bitch. No, no. So Damn. They're saying that <laughs> Derek Rose is saying he's not sweating at all. That it's just that he can prove that this girl, because now other people are saying that they actually saw each other for a little bit. And that he actually stopped calling her. That there was two reasons why. She uh, got upset because all of a sudden he just wasn't accepting any of her calls. Uh-huh. And other people, then sure, you know what, you want to hear what her case is? So not only is she saying that they did it, deliver- like raped her, she's saying that he never reimbursed her for purchasing that toy. The toy? Yeah. yeah. You blew it right there, you <laughs> dumbass. <laughs> so it was the toy. Yeah, was the That's toy. your motive. They raped me and they raped me and they owe me money for the the dildo that I asked them to bring home. Mm-hmm. <laughs> they didn't reimburse me from my debit card. Mm-hmm. So she's saying that, uh, he's saying that they have proof and that he said, this is just the devil at work on me. And everybody's like, well, be prepared, dude, because this is minor. You got to watch broke. out. Because he's claiming that he's not going to change his lifestyle. And so all his good people are like, oh, what did that mean? Like, in other words, I'm going to keep doing stuff like this. But it was consensual. But, but it's like, when people say watch. rape... I always look at the dude because rapists you know what? do mean? shit like that. That's their thing. Right. I got homeboys who done went to jail for the same shit. Yeah. And it be having to do with that. But they swear up and down, no. Now, if it's somebody first time, I believe you. Mm. It ain't nothing that's going to make me doubt because who going to take some pussy out there in these streets? Well, she, they was at her house. Especially she if you invited don't have him to. over. She let him in security house. Yeah. So. Especially if you don't, don't have to. be taking pussy. Mm. Right. That's mm-hmm. stupid. Pussy, yeah. Dumbass. The charge, trust me, niggas know the charge when it comes to doing some shit like that. It's mm. just not worth it. Right. right. So when a girl says she got raped by somebody who ain't never did that before, I'm skeptical. Right. I heard that. I'm skeptical. I agree. I agree. The, 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 the penalty is too severe to be taking pussy. Yeah, that's when, right. God damn it, if you have $20 and a strong stomach. <laughs> and some gum. Right. <laughs> it might not be the bitch you want, but I can get you some pussy. In I fact, the, I'm sure it ain't going to be the bitch you want. Right. I think the more interesting part of this story is that uh, his response when they asked him about you know, all the stuff that's going on in his personal life. He started talking about his contract. Ah. He started talking about when he's a free agent and, you know, taking Which care is of what, his. Next year? That's two years. Oh, two more years. So a lot of people are, uh, especially, you know, uh, you know, sports, ana- you know, guys or mm-hmm. commentators are upset because they're like, man, you've been hurt a long time and you owe it to the fans of Chicago to play out your contract. You shouldn't be talking about. 
you know, two years from now. Fuck them white And what's crazy is he gets <laughs> he gets hurt today. So practice, fuck them. Yeah. That's just crazy. That fuck is. you, pay me. If they don't pay him, somebody will. Somebody going to pay him now. Because he, he's a player. When he on the court, he can help. And when he's healthy, he's a player. Motherfucker, like they said, John Wall say they gave that one motherfucker who went to Detroit eighty million. Well, that's what mm-hmm. that's what he was saying. The motherfucker who he wasn't was saying even there's started. a lot of money, and he says I need to make sure. That, and what motherfuckers know. do need to understand about Derrick Rose? He he's very composed, mm-hmm. but Derrick Rose is from the motherfucking street. <laughs> this is a Chicago look nigga, <laughs> right? Thank God he can hoop. You know what I mean, mm-hmm. right? So all when when, when you talking to them reporters and everything, it's like. You gotta be careful what I'm you worried, say because they're gonna yeah, take it and can, run. Yeah. They can set him up. Right? Yeah. They can well, that's what they up. did. As soon as he said that, mm-hmm. they flipped it and turned it in. Oh, man, you dissing the, the, the people of Chicago. Uh-huh. Now he's gonna be reserved when he speaks because he knows. He gotta be got to be careful. He got, he got people around him to coach him, right? I yeah. met his brother. He got people around him to let him know, hey, hey, no. Woo, woo, woo. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So when you're talking, to, you're talking to the media, which is the worst people in the world, which yeah. is why you can't right. see their face. Because yeah. right. if you saw who was talking to those athletes, you would be like, why are they talking to him? <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> right. Like, right. right. No? Those right. are mm-hmm. fucking bigots. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right. Bigots, They're what? Bigots. Big, bigots and um, what's, what's an old school term for uh, being gay? What's it? Uh, what's the old term? Pansy. Queer. Pansies. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Homosexual. <laughs> Do people still say that? Sugar Are you a homosexual? Tank, sugar in the tank, sweet, yeah. <laughs> Turd <laughs> detectives. <What>? Right. <laughs> what? <laughs> mm. Shirt lifters. <laughs> shirt. <laughs> shirt lifters. That's what we call him. Right. He's a shirt lifter, he is. A pillow biter. Oh, he's a pillow, a pillow biter. Somewhat of a poof. <laughs> right. He's a poof, he is. <laughs> Right, goddamn. He fancies pink a quite quite a bit. <laughs> he likes to wear a lot of pink. <laughs> pink ties, pink pink pants and trousers. <laughs> trousers. Air sleeve cleaners. Ah, <laughs> so he a, a fanny bandit. <laughs> fanny no. bandit. Colon cowboys. No. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Speaking of, uh, Rectum Rangers. Ouch. Rectum Rangers. Anyway, all right. If anybody is. Uh, <coughs> Shit <stop>. Easy Makers. <laughs> Shit, easy man. <laughs> what is easier to shit? Like, I, it be people talking about, man, I can't pass a bow. Get fucked in the ass. I guarantee you, goddamn it. You're going to go. Oh, All right, let's, shit let's, out your ass. let's move on before it gets gross. I see, <laughs> I, 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 see, I, see it, I see it heading in that direction. Ain't no before. pirates. You they can't going wait in. too long on that it's kind of It's called starting the shit. Right, here we go. <laughs> Oh God! Okay, let's move on. Koi catchers. <laughs> let's move on. All right, get ready for those pictures. All right, so if you're thinking of visiting New York City with your family, you might want to think again, especially if you've never even gone there before or you have young children, uh, because the people of New York City, the businesses Sausage are sheriff. complaining because uh, you know how it is completely legal to walk around naked. Where? In New York City. Times you bullshit. Time. Swear to God. So. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. So naturalists are going well, out of control right now. So I'm now New York. Though. I got some picture. Watch. So most of the people are doing it artsy because they're like, okay, well, well this is how far we're going to take it. And some people are just straight out walking. <laughs> butt ass naked dudes, everything. I Look, some pictures. I've seen a woman yeah. today. In the middle naked. of Times Square. They're not naked. No, they have they, on panties. Yeah, she no, got on panties. She has on panties. But they're topless. No, she's deciding to wear panties. There's some that are full on naked well, that are wearing This is an internet show. Show. Let Hold the on. let the monkey be seen. We got it. There's a painted monkey. monkey. There's one that has a painted monkey. But wait, the best one is are the men. The men that do not care. They don't so even one man. No. Don't even have are, no they, are they are they Ready. Caucasian men? <laughs> one's black and one's good. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of different people that are just. Right, so they not up in the Bronx with that butt no, naked it's, it's, shit. It's, no, <laughs> they hustling out there. If it's a black man naked, he hustling. Somebody right. said anyway, the a lot on the of the left is ready. Are saying they're upset that the law that that law to be completely uh, n- uh, naked is hurting their um, businesses because a lot of families and tourists are not going in that area because they're like this is ridiculous, this is crazy. Because then now some people are taking. There you go. There goes one. It's she's literally butt naked, the Where? top and bottom. She yeah. just yeah, over there. Orange juice, that tang <laughs> on the foot. <laughs> <Got some> tang. <laughs> 
Tang powder. So, right. so a lot of the fully nude models have Candy been trying to paint coochie. themselves so they can. But they're walking around daily on a daily basis. There's some they're walking. You should so if you go online, you could see pictures of kids in the front like this. <gasps> they got a few like, more weeks of that shit. Winter on the way. Oh, I see, Chris. You want right. to put the male one up? Uh huh. Put the man one up. Fuck on. it. This fifty one fifty. Guys, it's a white guy and a brother. Yeah. Okay, darling. What a picture. He didn't get that I did. I sent it. Oh, that's good. You know what? I well, have you know, it on they're my just phone. trying to change anyway. Times Square. Yeah. To, because it used to be a really black, it, bad place. It sure did. And now they're bringing in businesses. They, you know, they're just yeah, trying cause, to. Cause, it's, uh, Disneyland no. now. it's Disneyland. It's Disneyland. Motherfuckers who jack people don't want to be around Remember naked that? men. Yeah. Nah. I ain't robbing no naked motherfucker. Fuck that. Yo, oh, there's Shane, all kinds of naked people. If they right naked, now. yo, the deal's off, son. I ain't fucking with no naked niggas, yo. <laughs> So they're trying to crack down on it. Pick How you gonna naked oh. nigga? Right, man. You gotta you go rob a ass. naked motherfucker. Where your wallet? Matter of fact, never ass. mind. Oh, what are you doing? Yo, carrying? man, this nigga got a dookie wallet. Oh, yeah. What the fuck is going on this nigga, here? This nigga, a dookie man. wallet? This motherfucker, dookie money wallet. full of shit, Joe. Yo. There it is. Look at this. this is the space in the background. Okay, Darlene got me. She showed me the naked man. Oh, God. I got the rainbow colored on his <laughs> on his dick. But what the, the but fuck the is that? <laughs> Gay man's paradise. You know, but look, all, all, anybody can. You can go out there if you'd like. Oh, man, look, goddamn. But the sister's face <laughs> in the background is gene, is is classic. Anyway, they're trying to control that. Where's the sister face in the background? Right there. Where? Oh yeah, she looking at that motherfucker <laughs> like them nasty motherfuckers. <laughs> it looks like she has right. 50 50 That's way, New York know. is not a, a place you, you want to be naked. You know how no. filthy that mother. You yeah. sitting on a train with your nasty with your, yo. You gonna catch hey, something? Hey, people out are going there. crazy. Did you see? Two months ago, they had the three hundred uh, over three hundred people bike riding through L.A. butt naked. Top I didn't bottom. see that. I, oh, you didn't? No, I'm not gonna lie. Freeze. Let me riding tell you the bicycles. But y'all naked. gonna have to give me a pass. Uh-oh. If it's a bike ride, there was naked, Corey. We're gonna have to let you know about it. We're I like, want to do this. Stop shit. it! <laughs> That's it. We're gonna. I want to ride my bike naked. That's it. Damn I it. want my bike and sail the bike seat the when I'm through. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get the information. If you, for you. put that hit, bike seat on eBay, tell you that shit sound fun. But if you hit the curb or a patch of sand, you scraping your ass and nuts up. <laughs> Ah. I can't. I can't. Instant I can't. vitiligo, nigga. Yeah, instant. <laughs> you break a bone. You, when you break a bone, you waiting on the paramedics naked. Oh, naked. Think I about can't. that. Motherfucker, be like, I ain't got no pants. Put this rub on, nigga. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's a, it's a blue nine see through rubber. Last thing uh, I want to bring up, uh, uh, George Zimmerman. He's still trying to make himself in the news, get himself in the this news on things. Bitch. This idiot. He um. Ain't nobody popped that motherfucker yet. Damn. Exactly. He recently tweeted, retweeted because somebody else put it up um, with his hashtag on it. So he liked what he saw, I guess, because he retweeted a actual photo of Trayvon Martin's dead body. I'd have popped his ass. If that was my son, I'd pop that motherfucker. I ain't saying that shit to be rubbing it in on no shit like that, man. But that motherfucker need to be dead. I don't give a fuck who played his back. George Zimmerman, that motherfucker killed a young black teenager unarmed, and he got old, off yeah. because of this fucked up system. Zimmerman need to be popped in the motherfucking head in front of his mama. And whoever posted this. And I'm so just whoever, saying, like, what happened? Whatever, 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 whatever happened? Whatever happened to... If you know you did some shit, right. some foul shit, and you got off, whatever happened to just go the fuck away and go be away. quiet right. and stay out of trouble. Right. Been this way, man. Yep, like whatever been happened this to way. that. He that motherfucker who jumped shit off, man. Yep. And he, his brother, his brother. You know he is. worked for somebody though. His brother. That's my thing. That it's authentic. The account, the Twitter account is authentic. It is George's, his brother's account. And then they said shortly afterwards, but you can still look it up. Um, they said shortly afterwards, um, of course, he deleted them. Um, but his account, he deleted the photos of Trayvon, but his account still is filled with disturbing tweets um, that says, you know, um, cops' lives matter and blah, blah, blah. He has a bunch of other... He's trying to join the cop side because he tried to... Look, the man had an altercation with police and beat it because of who his dad is. Mm. The man need... The man need... I, You know, I, I'm i just saying, if you out there on the streets and you on that bullshit... <sighs> mm. You done did dirt. If you see this motherfucker, you got to get him. Oh. Just on GP, because you out here on dirt anyway. <laughs> you oh, you got to pop this you motherfucker. You grind me anyway. 
Right. right. The, the How could you black not? people of America owe him to be laid out in the street, <sighs> motherfuckers standing over them with their phones taking pictures. Why uh, he? Why he God. leaking? This nah, is one he got, motherfucker who, who hmm. definitely him and that cop from Ferguson. Now there's a whole oh, yeah. bunch of them well, like them who them. ain't got caught. They but I'm saying they don't. They don't. They they, they been do on blast else. for doing their shit, and them That's motherfuckers right. was standing on it. So mm-hmm. let's stand on their head in the motherfucking streets. Man, they, he got to work for somebody. Though. There's something weird. Like, How you just he, stay around doing dumb that. shit? Right. No, he ain't out no more. Do you right. think Zimmerman is around well, where it him? jump off at? Where this no, motherfucker not at? Where it jump off this at? Right. He's on Golden Pond. Right. He doing right. that shit from the safety of somewhere safe. <laughs> yeah. Right. He gotta be. Yeah. He ain't out here in the fields. No. I mean, trust no. me. And, and also, uh, just to end it on, well, it's kind of a sad note. Any Anthony Anderson, another divorce this year. We had Chris Rock earlier, Nick and Mariah. Anyway, Anthony Anderson, uh, wife filed for divorce. They were uh, married for almost twenty years, uh, and they have two kids, and um, they're getting a divorce. Another divorce. He lost okay. weight. She looked like how. You know what? It used to go down when he had that weight on. No, she's a good-looking woman. <laughs> Let me see the picture. And again. for having two children. And they've been very young. Let me see the picture, D. There, there she's I think she's Hold on. I think she's beautiful. Okay. She's very attractive girl. But he got a show on NBC. He got a show on NBC. ABC. ABC. One of the C's. Same thing. One of the main networks, yeah. right? Network. Yeah. 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 Network. Oh yeah. Real network. He lost weight where he could tuck it. See his pants tucked there? <laughs> That's danger. Well, that's, that's danger. That's danger from bitches from back in the day. Damn, I can and do better. I know very that. Charming, nice fellow. I know they. I know that's they didn't have this art. Yeah, bitch, I could be getting those. Oh, so, had that Anthony Anderson, listen, listen. listen. All right. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't even argue. He said, <laughs> <laughs> "I tell you what, there's a checkbook in there. You write them out. I'll sign it. See you." Yeah. Uh, you know, motherfuckers don't be wanting to get that money up. But well, 20 she years. Wants, yeah, 20 years. She wants spousal support, and the children are older on the older side. One's 15, one's 19. But um, I don't know. Hey, man, I mean, man. I wish She's them a beautiful both, woman. Yeah, I wish them both well. Right. It's, so it's you too ain't bad. fair. You say everybody beautiful. That's what takes the credibility I, I, away right. from what Look, you say. She had is. two kids. And Look at her body. Her body's still natural. nice. And she got the natural she look, She got the Corey. chocolate on her, man. That's a beautiful woman. She's a nice looking lady. Oh, here we go. So hey. you're telling me that woman is bad. Hey, Whoopi is bad. What Years is, ago, Whoopi that was looks like nice. the crow, no. That bitch looks like the crows off the whiz, goddammit. Right. You was... can't you win. Oh, you know what? You can't win. Why did I undo it? I <laughs> you can't win, child. Damn, she does got the crows. You can't win. Tell me she don't look like the crows off the wig. She doesn't have any makeup on, and then you guys responded. I'm telling you. It don't matter if she ain't got makeup. Oh, she bet. still look like the crows off the wig. She don't now, look I that say, bad. I wouldn't say that Come if they on. were still together, but now she part of the streets. Oh, here we go. She out here in the game, so she got to get the crows. She got oh, that pulled my. back look. Right. <laughs> Like she looking in a reflection in the spoon. Remember on Beetlejuice when they pulled that shit back? Uh, oh, come right. on. Right. Right. Lord the have mercy. The woman is not anyway, that bad. I wish come them on. both well, and they're both still young enough where they can kind of get out there. And the kids are older. They're good to go. The kids are older. I'm yeah, not mad prepared. at us. I'll smash, but it's Anthony. <laughs> Cassius. I'm just saying. No, I won't smash literally like, oh, yeah. I'm looking for her to smash. But I'm just saying if we was on a desert island, uh, you know, I could find some rum. <laughs> anyway, uh, if, if we was on a desert, would you like I, some of this coconut? <laughs> it's out of control. I know. You can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they gonna have them crows off the wheels on there. Oh, they gonna have them right next to them crows because this the internet and this is what we do. She You're not bad. Right. They had a picture of me like I was Ving Rhames. Uh, oh, with the gimp. Yeah, like I was, <laughs> I was laughing at that motherfucker from the little artist nigga. Alex King. I don't get mad when people. Gag on me. People can talk Look, about they me. Got me. Look at this bullshit. That shit. <laughs> oh, they killed. They I saw that shit. Y'all niggas is bullshit. That's what we really Y'all is. Y'all saw that when they had this no. bitch up before? <laughs> no, who was that? They, that who they, was they, that? They, they, some they, Arab dude. They said some nigga doing comedy and I write. This thing you said. Hey, man. Hell look. no, it's not me. Them motherfuckers on the internet don't gag on you. They do. They do. They go gag on you. They go heavy. They do, man. 
Anyway. Well. Wait a minute. Chat Corey, room. What up, baby? Chat room. What they say? Hardest back. Corey the Gimp. No, they didn't have me as the Gimp, but they had me with that ball in my mouth like I was Bing Rain. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> they did that to you. you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but look, man, you can't be sensitive fucking with this show. I'm telling you, I'm going to bring my wife on here because I know what's going to happen. She ain't going to want to come back. How many people have sat up here and we, they be like, I ain't coming back there. Shit, fuck them motherfuckers. <laughs> 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 fuck them motherfuckers. <laughs> It's hard. Are we, we going to get, what's the name back? Who? Anoush. Anoush. No, I don't, think, I don't think she'll come Tell back. Tell me how much. Stop I it. Damn it, all the heck. I hold you. Damn it. Michael Bolton side of the game. Damn. Now that my. Oh, God, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> That's what you say. Kenny G side That's what you said. Yeah, you fucking choked. Kenny G. Damn. Chuck Man Jones. I know how you switch it up. What the hell? That ain't Kenny G? No, that's Chuck Man Jones. I got Kenny G. Paul Hart. No, who is that? That's Axel Foley music. Axel Foley. Yes, and that's not Axel Foley. That's what Eddie Murphy was the shit. He plays sax, Corey. Oh my god. No, okay, that's it. That's it. I'm done. I'm done. Michael Bolton. Michael Bolton. Bolton. Well, when we go off. Michael Bolton, number one jam. Uh, I'm not supposed to live without you, right? Wait a second. Chris, Mm. you were just on an airplane with him. Remember when he started playing? He started playing sax for a married couple and he recorded it. Oh, Kenny G. My Mm. bad. I knew it was a sax. Kenny G was on the plane with you, Chris? Yeah, and he recorded And he recorded it. He was singing for a couple. Oh, he, or he, he was playing yeah. coy sax. He, right, he was, that nigga was oh, blowing stop. up sax at Chris and shit. Yo, shit. <laughs> he let Chris <laughs> use his saxophone. Chris is far away. Chris is way in the back. He was don't like, replace. Him. <laughs> <laughs> you can throw this motherfucker away from me, guy. Wow, <laughs> this motherfucker melted away. in the front, <laughs> goddamn it. Oh, it's music. Like, <laughs> anyway, we about melted to take a break. Melted brass. Damn. Yes, let's take a break. When we come back, Porter we'll, stole the saxophone. They put it in the gut. <laughs> Maybe we'll have that meme of Corey with the the Whoa, gym set up. Shit. Uh-huh. Anyway, we'll be right back. We'll be right back. We'll be right back. <laughs> oh, we, we, we going to break? Yeah. All right, yeah. going to break, y'all. Fuck it. We yeah. up. <laughs> Truth to the youth. 
I say, hey, you, here's the truth. You better start wearing bulletproof. I teach the truth to the youth. I say, hey, you, here's the truth. You better start wearing bulletproof. I teach the truth to the youth. I say, hey, you, here's the truth. You better start wearing bulletproof. You, here's the truth. Start wearing bulletproof. Youngster, youngster, this is your life. Things will go wrong. Things will go right. Never go light. Always go hard. Don't be no more with no hope call. Cause the police want to get you. And the haters plot to get you. Golden and hoes want your shit too. If you're weak, they'll pussy whip you. Think your shit through. Don't go on one. Learn to drive first. If you're gonna run, hype your engine. Make your whip fast. Fix the rattle in your whip's ass. If you pass dubs and your shit rubs, get your shit tub. Lift your shit up. Get insurance, registration, get your license, quit your playing. I teach the truth to the youth. I say, hey, you, here's the truth. You better start wearing bulletproof. I teach the truth to the youth. I say, hey, you, here's the truth. You better start wearing bulletproof. I teach the truth to the youth. I say, hey, you, here's the truth. You better start wearing bulletproof. You, here's the truth. Start wearing bulletproof. Youngster, youngster, get your mind right. Fuck the street bang, fuck the limelight. Cause nobody digs to show off. Heads get too big, heads get blown off. If you got it and you flown it, fools plot on it. Cause they want it. Watch your best friend, yeah, y'all go back. But your own crew will peel your cap. Bump, jump, they split. You get socked up. Cops hit, they snitch. You get locked up. Act too damn hard, get your ass kicked. Stunt too damn hard. Or floss a casket if you jack in. One time, one time, one time. 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 One time, Feeling myself, but never don't pop deep. Feel yeah. lucky tonight, I might attract one queen. Body so perfect, yeah. body so mean, she has swell the Bible. I was doing my thing, let me boil you in. I need to say something. Come here, know what you like. Let your mind go free. Nice and nice, it's only you and me. I know what you want, she wanna go with the homie. Built like a stallion, I'll accept gladly. I know what you yeah. want, she wanna party with me. Bring out your nice. friends, and I'ma bring my peeps. I know what you like, what you like is me. Real as can be, let your mind go free. Come fly tonight, come fly tonight, come fly tonight. Girl, do your thing. Girl, do your thing. Come fly tonight, come fly tonight, come fly tonight. Girl, do your thing. Girl, do your thing. Do your thing. She ain't man, but she treat her badly. She ain't got no luck, cause she's unhappy. He been cheating for a while. She wanna creep, say the look in my eyes, make her fall so deep. I know you got girlfriends, you so fine, lost it for a second. Wanted you to be mine, flowing like an angel, do a hot thing, let me fall you in. I need to say something, I know what you like, let your mind go free. Tonight's the night, it's on you and me. I know what you want, but you wanna go with on me. Built like a stallion, I'll accept gladly. I know what you want. Timeless. Charge where you're holy with the ice with them. 
bikinis and them empty gold bottles with a red Lamborghini, nigga. You ain't full throttle, ain't no zeros in the count. You live in the dream world, niggas tossing up your bitch. You fuck with a dream girl. Some of for fighting, some of for dying. Freeze and gladiator. There you go. Some of for fighting, some of for dying. All right, all right. Anyway. All right. What up, y'all? Hmm. I was motherfucking sitting around the other day hmm. trying to figure this out because it's not a question that's asked on television. Um. It's the topic this week, and I just feel like somebody needs to say it and talk about it. Um, who know the topic? You know it, D? Yeah, we all got it, but what is it? You want me to? You don't read know it, it. D. He sent it to me. Okay, D. Well, you read the topic, Lord, then. Lord, Jesus. Here we go. You have to pick the one without the glasses on. Okay, hang on. They got to put them glasses mm-hmm. on and activate them eyes activators. <laughs> Not funny. Okay, Corey. I'm telling you right now, you think you seeing all right. I see I see all right. Oh, you think you do. Sandra Flake about that part. (laughs) She good, goddammit. Mm -hmm. You look like goddammit, this is somebody um punching you in the stomach right now. What? I'm trying to focus, (laughs) dang it. Fuck it, D. These aren't uh uh oh where is it? She got another pair of glasses. Put them on, see if they work. Where did I put it? Up here? That's like Fred Sanford. He got like yeah, hold on. <laughs> he got like thirty pairs of glasses, <laughs> and then the glasses come out. Oh, know. I can't find it. All right, D. Oh, send it to me, Chris. I oh, he sent it to all of us. That's Crap. the problem. I got it. I know why. Oh, well, you look. got it. Oh, Freeze got oh, it. Freeze, read you. that shit. What's the topic Lord. this week? Why can't? <laughs> hold, on. hold on. Why <laughs> keep a man, lady? Oh, oh yeah. Let me see what that motherfucker say. Right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bring me your check. Now let me see it. <laughs> Give me my magnifying glass. <laughs> we gonna see if you gonna <laughs> make the cut. The shoes with the ham on it. Oh, that was your friend. No, Shut up. <laughs> the shoes with the ham. On the, the ham boots. Yeah. Ham boots. That's that. That's that meat. That's that meat Rocky, Rocky was punching in the first week. <laughs> hey, okay, yeah. say it again because you yeah, were so win. you were interrupted. Meat boots. <laughs> These niggas. Oh, was... the the topic. Yes. They didn't like the way I said. Oh, says, Why well. can't you keep a man, lady? That's the topic. Uh, Why can't you keep a man, lady? Well, if wow. there were men around, maybe. I would. Oh, we can't. That's the them. that's the typical answer. Right? <laughs> I was going to say, you don't blame men because you can't keep one. No, is the that thing right? is... Well, that's what they do on television. That's no, why I that is funny. Up. No, that's, that is a good, like, popular saying. But no, the thing is, is it's funny even asking that. Why can't you keep a man? How about we... It just is what it is. If I'm running into people and it's just not the right timing, then it just isn't the right timing. I'm not going to just stick with somebody because I want a man in my presence. If it's just not happening, it's not happening. I'm all right with that. I get and it. I could have several men. That's what's going down right now in this part of my lifetime right now where the kid's gone, got no other responsibilities, don't have one special dude. I can run the gamut. I could do it. Okay. So I, I have special guys for different scenarios. I am right? woman. Hear me roar. roar. Arr. 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 Anyway. So, you, so I don't see but nothing. But if one of them, no, but if one of them really, if one of them positions himself in that right position, then... Let's go for it. But another one, right now, it's not, it's not happening like that. that. And it's okay. Just... It's all right. I'm not looking for, you know, any particular. Took this topic seriously right here, boy. I ain't think about that shit. <laughs> uh, I am the only woman in the room. I and forgot I that when I thought of this topic. <laughs> D is like, fuck you, nigga. No, I don't care. Can't keep a man. Women don't want to keep you, nigga. <laughs> right. Well, <laughs> I would love to have a man that I want to keep. Boy, I, woo, 
what well, would no, take care of him? Well, no, let's look at it from the oh, perspective of having I a can't man, wait to rub feet. But then not being able to keep him once you have him. Well, then say la vie. Then they, that's all right. They ain't the end of the world. Let the chips fall. Let's just roll the dice. It's all right. She I'm not one of those. Let gonna, the chips fall where they, they may. Nigga. Next, Nick. And here we go. <laughs> <laughs> huh, what no. I was, what I want to say is, there are a lot of women, in my opinion, who take no responsibility for what they do mm-hmm. to put them in the position they're in. How about that? Yeah. All right. That, that, you know this. Definitely. You don't, oh, you don't a see lot. a lot of you know, women saying, I be fucking up with these men. Uh, right. It depends. If they're, if they're, You've seen some? Yeah. Actually, Tell us you know, about them. You know, a lot of my girlfriends, I think because they're on the older side, they do. They've admitted it. They're like, mm, mm-hmm. I, I'm, I, I get it now. It's, it's, that's, I've got a lot to do with it. And they're owning up to it. Because it just gets I've too been old and it just wears so them down. I've been so long, I finally see that I am and a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, think that, I think that a woman who is <laughs> taking ownership in her responsibilities of the fuck-ups, because right. they will take responsibility of the good shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. But they don't like to take responsibility of what's fucked up. Mm-hmm. That's the type of person that you can be around. But I just don't know a lot of women who want to admit that they don't know what the fuck they doing when it comes to picking a quality person to be around. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. Well, what do women look for when they're picking, Darlene? Everybody's different. And then let's We needed to have more women in here yeah, because you did. this ain't fair. It is. For Darlene to be yeah, getting everything. hit because, yeah, because no, 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 thing, no, 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 I don't care because I'm told I think I, I think I stand out. I really do. I yeah. don't want to toot my own horn, but I really do think that I my my particulars mm. are 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 different from a lot of other women. Like I I'm a I'm big into family. Right. So I want you to be cool with that. Like family guy. You want to be around my family a lot. You know all that stuff. I like to volunteer. So either you gonna go with me and do it, or you just don't have a problem with me being gone. We should have somebody call our one line. But we gotta, we yeah. gotta, we gotta get a woman. Because, a woman. Yeah. We call want a woman. Call. Women gonna call. Yeah. Women, women are scared to admit they are fans of the fifty one fifty. Oh no! Hell no! Women who cutie pie, with cutie a pie. Man. If you're watching, call the show. She's one of our. So our all the dudes don't call. Yeah. There are women no, in there. No, no, I'm talking about mm. women who are with their man. Yeah. Most oh. of them are proud 5150 watchers. Oh, so yeah. But I'm saying single. all the women who are sitting at home right now yeah. not admitting they're watching the show. Okay, so they don't have to give their real name. How about that? No, you don't have to give your real yeah. name. Give your real opinion of why That's right. you have um, a overworked vagina and oh wow, really, really? a lonely, <laughs> lonely, lonely. <laughs> I, I, I do believe though that part of my problem couldn't be that I'm just really clingy. Like I want, I want to be with him. I want to be with him a lot. So if you don't oh. like that, like I want to do everything for him. I want to, you know, I want to care him. Yeah. I want so the number to dial is what? Mm-hmm. Uh huh. Get a, get oh, the number caller. to dial, oh, preferably women, um, area code 605-215-5150. Mm-hmm. Yes. One more time. 605-215-5150. This is Chris's you little puss that, ass phone. Blow <laughs> that motherfucker up. Yeah. up. God, God damn, damn it. it. Destroy <laughs> that puss ass battery. <laughs> anyway, Call this right. motherfucker well into Thursday. Right, that little 711 <laughs> charger ain't going to keep that motherfucking battery on. <laughs> I'm gonna, get, uh, I'm gonna get me a little older man that just wants to chill and stay at home. And we hey, D, why don't you make family? me some Let's soup, go. some yeah. grits, baby? Yeah. Darling, let's have a good game of backgammon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I still want him able to. Pete Knuckle, even. I still want what the old Jamaican to... motherfucker tell him? <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah, darling. Remember when you fixed me a big pot of porridge and come sit by my man? <laughs> porridge. Yeah, man, did you just say porridge? porridge. Yes, yes, he did. You don't, you don't eat porridge in the morning. You oh. have to eat, eat the omni porridge. I man. forgot Hominy, about Hominy porridge. porridge. Banana porridge, omni porridge. <laughs> Uh, you know me getting a big fight with the Jamaican no. people, man. I tell them I don't eat porridge. Porridge is for orphans. <laughs> Stop. Eat no damn porridge. That's what the man freeze love say. That's, so what, that's what bears eat. Let's right. play Uno, Darlene. Come on, let's go play some I Uno. I would love to. Naked Uno. Uno. Let's do it. Naked Uno. Say, hey. I say it was Here sleep. we Good go. Say. There we go. Yeah. Baby. That's right. I'm so let's get a lady caller. Yeah. 
I hope we can get a lady caller because I want to say to all of the women who are lonely, who have absolutely nobody, Mm -hmm. are you hard to be around? Why would you say that, motherfucker? (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. What kind of question is that, nigga? (laughs) Maybe you hard to be with. (laughs) The, The people who have been around you, do they have mostly unpleasantries as they speak on you? Fuck whatever they got to say. The motherfuckers don't know me. <laughs> that motherfucker doing what the fuck he supposed to do. I wouldn't have been doing that. <laughs> That's the number so. one shit. Whatever I'm around, I ain't gonna lie. A ghetto bitch saying that, you might as well piss on me. I will you get the what? fuck away from you when I hear you say, well, if you do what you're supposed to do, then I might do what I'm supposed to do. Whenever I used to say, oh, my. One more time, nigga. Yeah, but that's right. Yeah, whack yeah, bitch yeah. right there. Yeah. 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 That's time. right, motherfucker. If you on top of your shit, I'll be on top of my shit. <laughs> <laughs> do what you're oh, supposed to is, do. Do what you're supposed to do, nigga. Right, I right, do what right. I'm supposed to do. Oh, <laughs> That's the worst bitch in the world. When a bitch say Ooh. that, get the fuck away. Run. And Uh-oh. That's the Uh-oh. Call Uber. Hey. Call a cab. We got a cab. We got a caller. Oh, we got to hear it. Right. Right. email caller. Right, let's let's see, what see what we got here. What the blood clot has to say. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she hung up. Oh my god. Security cat. Right, didn't even have a call. Yes, the, it was when coming. I put I the it. Ladies, call us 605 215 5150. The number to dial Ugh. again that is 605. That was the gay mayor with his voice high. Hello. 215 5150. Can I come sit with you guys? <laughs> what? No, Steal your ideas. Corey, you're talking right through the call. You'd already answered it. Hello. We got another one? All yeah. right. Here it's we girl. go. Girl. Press one to send a voice. That's call. the operator. Okay, hold on. There okay, we go. Okay, do we have the girl Hello? or no? Hello? Yay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Who is you this? Don't, you don't sound like you're struggling to breathe, sister. <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? <laughs> no, don't worry about it, don't baby. You. We was um, I'm trying. No, I didn't hear you. No, I said something funny. Like I said, you don't sound like you're struggling to breathe, as if you don't sound like you are overweight. <laughs> no. No. I, I can tell. Yeah. The, the clarity. Ooh, hey. No, I'm kidding. The, the clarity. Girl, Harmony Clown. Hey, Harmony. Hey, what's up, Harmony Clown? Clown? Hey. What it do? How old are you? So, I am, ooh, you're never supposed to ask a lady her age, you but I'll tell us. you if you Come want on. me to. I okay. Like, I'm 31. Oh, okay. She got a little, right. she got a little experience. Girl, I just wanted people to have an idea of what age bracket was talking yeah. about their experience. But we want to know, do you have a man? I do. Okay. All right. Well, what do you think about do. what do you think about women who may be your friends or whatever who don't have a man but always complain about men? They mess with the wrong kind. Thank you. Ah, mm-hmm. right. Like they don't they don't learn a lot about the man. Mm-hmm. They go about oh they're cute oh they popping bottles they doing this they doing that and then when the time comes to like show what's really going on what's real it's like. They flake, and then the girl gets mad. Oh, well, they weren't around for me. Mm. Yeah, because you didn't choose them right. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. I wanted to hear a woman say that. Because when I said you know it, I mean? it, like, it mm-hmm. right. you have to do your research. If you're gonna, if We went to school for how many years to do research on homework. You're going to do homework on people. Mm. There you go, Harmony. That's All right. right. Harmony mm-hmm. has her head screwed That's on right. right. So We're how long have you been with your man, Harmony? Um, almost eight years. Right on. All there right. you go. All right. Yeah, All right. I'm engaged. So we're getting married soon, but I mean, you you just gotta. Women nowadays just have to learn to stop being <laughs> stupid about things. You know what I mean? And I I hate to say this because I'm a female myself, but you just gotta you gotta learn the mental game and just be with the person that's gonna respect you and love you. And you have to be with them through time and not just oh because they're showing me something mm-hmm. in that one moment that is gonna be that. Like you sound that. very right. wise. One more question though, um, how? Do you guys have a date set to get uh, married, or are you just engaged um, on the This Sound Good tip? Well, we're just engaged right now. It's kind of like, in, you know, enjoying the time to be engaged. So, I mean, we haven't set a date yet, but it's hopefully soon. Okay. Well, listen, Harvey. <laughs> 
We appreciate the phone call. And I got much respect, and That's I hope right. that thing. I hope that thing end up in now, a marriage. I, I want to say, I just want to say, fifty one fifty nation. I love you guys, and I'm always gonna tune in. I love you guys for real. Keep it up. I love you guys. Thank, Thank you. you. We Thank love you, you as well. Right. We love so you. Much love, the love going around. Congratulations, I like, to y'all. I like her voice too. She yeah, she's, she's uh-huh. she has um, what I she call sounded happy. Corey. She's alive. There you go. You know what I mean? <laughs> Some women ain't alive. They be like, yeah. <laughs> As soon as you say something, you be like, I'm going to go to the store. You ain't going to go to the store. <laughs> <laughs> right, zombie Why don't you just be honest with me? <laughs> walking Dead now. Now it's a Walking Dead. But that's what they do. Walking know, Dead hoes. <laughs> I remember, I, I remember I told this girl, I said, hey, I'm going to call you tomorrow. She said, you ain't going to call me. <laughs> like you got a phone. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't going to be thinking about me when I get off this phone. Oh <laughs> you got damn right, bitch. I heard that. Uh-huh. that well, more yeah. ladies, please call in. The number to dial is area code 605-214-5150. Do you to think, know somebody for right. sure. Women. We want to hear from women. Call women, us right women, now. Women, women, if you take some advice from a fool, which I, I, I'm i a fool, mm-hmm. I just want you to know that every time you do something simply because it's what you want to do, right. you are setting yourself up to oh, be yeah. in a bad predicament. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You need to just just. Just make somebody earn something. I'm not saying, let me tell you something, waiting on sex, that ain't that ain't always the answer. Mm-hmm. But I'm saying like the man that you fucking with, what how did y'all meet and how did it how did it get to the point where y'all began to fucking around? I think yeah. you really need to a- ask yourself that. Right. Did he meet you at um Denny's across <laughs> the street from the county building? Yeah. <laughs> and he had a nice car. Oh we got somebody yeah. on the line, maybe she can answer that. Hey, we got a girl on the line, yeah. another girl. That's what's Lady up. Nation is in the motherfucking house. Who this? Hello. Hey. hey. Harmony, you call back? No. <laughs> no, this isn't harmony. Oh, that's oh not they, harmony. They, they don't like each other. <laughs> no, this is not harmony. She don't want to be. She don't want to be. <laughs> she don't want to be mistaken for harmony. I'm right. someone else, nigger. <laughs> right. <Stop. laughs> hey, okay. uh, so you don't have to tell your exact age. We just want to know your age group. Over forty. Nice. Over forty. All right. Now we got yeah. some, we got some wisdom on the line. Yeah. Goddamn yeah. it! Been through some changes. Goddamn it! <laughs> seen a few things. Been out there. Yeah, that's got right. them tubes tied. Yeah, I've, seen, I've seen a few things. I am single, um, divorced. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And um, um, I've been divorced for about five years. Mm. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, kind of sound. Did that, that sound phony? Yeah, that sounds sorry. Then a motherfucker. I I'm am sorry, sorry she's not married anymore. But <laughs> she's not. She's what we want to know is now. what happened. Why? Why don't you? Do you have a man now? I'm single right now. Okay. Well, what happened with you and your husband? Why didn't it work? Was it something you did, he did, or y'all did? I would say we did. Um, I think I was at a point in my life where I wanted to be married, and I settled for somebody that probably wasn't the right match for me. Mm. So I definitely learned from the experience. Mm. But then on the other side of it, he was younger, wasn't really ready for a committed relationship. Interesting. Mm-hmm. You just wanted somebody you could show off to your girls, huh? St- it's all good. You Not can tell that. the truth. Blow you out no, every really now and wanted, again. I was ready to have a family, so I was oh. probably, you know, overshooting. Mm. Oh, did you in guys anticipation ha- of that goal? Did you end up? Did you end up having children by him? No, I still don't have children. You didn't keep none, huh? Shut, Corey. What? what? Oh I know. He's but, um, was I, <laughs> this is this is. Oh, you never been pregnant. <laughs> oh. Didn't. Yeah, yeah, they, what they was, was he shooting? Right, that's what I'm saying. How he did? How Straight he, blanks. Sea salt. That Laffy taffy. Never. <laughs> Laffy taffy. Kept missing the seeds back then. <laughs> All right. Can you name three things that you're responsible for that ended this relationship? No. Um, she's 40. Um, I know she can. I'm rooting for her. I should. I probably should have never been in the relationship. To right. Anyway, she already be said mm-hmm. one. Um, I didn't know how to allow him to lead. So we ended up doing counseling. One of the things my counselor advised me <sighs> of is I had to step back and let him fail. 
but I, because I was older, I had already lived that whole, you know, broke life. I didn't want to do that anymore. So when he would drop the ball on things, I would pick up the ball and keep it going instead of letting mm-hmm. us suffer through it. So yeah. you were trying to fix something that just, you it was broke, and you just kept going with it. You try to keep it going. Exactly. Go ahead, Corey. You had yeah. something. You, yeah, what you the hell are you for really trying to say? I'm not laughing. I'm not, listen, I'm not laughing at anybody's she can situation. See you. <laughs> it's just, when she said, when, when she said <laughs> counseling, I know everybody who went to counseling, it was just a bill. It didn't help. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, especially if you already know the problem, off. which she already admitted it. She I, admitted it. I would say it, it helped me learn about myself because mm-hmm. I probably wouldn't be able to answer, um, you mm-hmm. know, how did I cause the problem or how did I contribute to the problem mm-hmm. before the, the counseling. Okay. Mm-hmm. That's what's okay. up. Well, All you, right. you, you, you. you in my book, God damn it, you can be worked with because you can stand up and say, it wasn't all somebody else's fault. There you go. I mean, that's the beginning of it. it that's the beginning, for real. Yeah. I'm not a counselor, but well, I know. we wish you when, the best. Yeah. That's we, for we sure. We definitely wish you the best. And I we appreciate you calling, there, sister. You were awesome. Yeah. Thanks for the call. I listen faithfully. I'm in Atlanta, so, you know, it's late out here. But oh. I do listen to you guys every week, uh, and uh, I love you guys all. Yeah. Would you go hey. on ahead and uh, tweet Mark us a uh, picture? Of you. Yeah, there they go. Zoe, hey, Corey, been doing this for years. <laughs> Zoe wants to see a picture. Here we go. What does she tweet the picture to, Chris? You know what? Uh, what? Don't, no. don't. What? Tweet it to your account? Oh, just a 50 We don't have a 50 You can tweet it, can account, tweet it to me, right. the Corey Holcomb. Yeah. Take a picture. We Jeez. Wanna, we want to yeah. see who you are, sister. We appreciate We've been doing your, this for years. All right. We appreciate you being bold. The Corey That's Holcomb. Right. That's what's up. <laughs> Represent, girl. All right. Have Thank a good one. Thank you. Um, so, what? listen. It was... I. <laughs> Freeze, you want to say some shit? No, no, no I, I, thought I, I thought about something earlier. Listen, I thought about something earlier, of course. You know he got something to say. I mean, look, I, I don't want to never sound like I'm evil or nothing. <laughs> no, 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 you, you said What was you going to say? I'm glad you backed off when you were doing that crazy old laugh of yours. <laughs> no, because I know a dude, and he spent a lot of money on counseling, and it was just funny when he was like, that bullshit ain't help, man. <laughs> <laughs> I he used to be to. rolling. He was like, yeah. man, we wasted our time. I'm sitting up here with this motherfucker. He was talking about the council. I'll beat this nigga ass. I'm sitting here talking to him. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. That's anyway, no. If I, your woman ain't scared of you, she's not going to act right. I thought about something you, you asked earlier when you said something about, you know, why am I single and all that. I have, have, I have met, out of the 13, 14 years I've been single, some really great guys. Two really potential got, standout guys that I could have really found myself with for the long haul. But both of them were um, much younger, and they wanted to pretty much start over what I already considered I've done already. So they wanted to start a family from day one and have a gang of kids. And I was like, I'm not having any. So I made the decision to say, hey, it's not going to happen. I can't. It's got. I got to be fair because I, I can't. I just can't settle down with them. What the hell was that? I, I just want to make sure I heard you <laughs> right. So you're saying you had younger suitors? Yes. One was... Younger yeah. suitors who wanted to hatch eggs with you, and that's what you want to call it, Corey. Yeah. Were, what, what, what happened? Were they not established? Were they no? They're really established. One of them, Matthew. You met the attorney. He's still a good friend of mine. That's the guy who used to come down to the foxhole. Yes, yeah. Yes. And he, um, great guy. No children. Very successful. Good looking fella. Gentleman. I took him to meet my grandmother. That was serious. That's the <laughs> only guy in all these all these years that I've been single. He and, went um, all the way out there to um that was that about an hour or something, right? Hour and a half. Yeah. Hour and a half. And we took my grandmother out to brunch and then he um helped her with the um What do y'all Google? Ice tea gone. <laughs> what is that? Somebody <laughs> What? <laughs> Everybody know Ice T is gone. God he been it. gone. Leave yeah, leave Ice T out of this. Exactly. That Law and Order son. I didn't bring him up. <laughs> and I am not. I don't know what that means, Darlene. You're selfish. Bless their heart. I am the least. Darlene, selfish. you're selfish. I am um, the least selfish. No, nah, Darlene. Just, I heart. mean, like if the if the guys wanted that and fair, you didn't have fair. that with them, that is something that I know you didn't want that with them. 
No, but the thing it's is... It's not that you didn't want it in life. It's you didn't want it with them. No, I don't want it in life. I'm done with that. How am no. I going to stay with somebody? It was him. And I'm this age. No, it's not. It was him. I knew he would resent it. I would resent it. He would resent staying down and then later on going... Because he was like, no. Well, we if LeBron okay. was like, D, I love you. Please have my baby. I'm not trying to have any more children. You no. got to put past the forehead issues and line oh, no. it. No, I know that, what you're talking about. You're had that little baby. I'm not into money or power. If Darlene and LeBron had a baby, what would be the defects of the baby? <laughs> we know that line it ain't going to be right because LeBron, you can't favor Well, if it's a little girl, she's going to favor the father. If it's a boy, he'll favor me. What if it's a little girl that favors LeBron? That's what I'm saying. She will, most wow. likely the little girls will favor the, the dads. Whew. So she'll look a like female Eighth LeBron. grade's going to be rough. You know that face LeBron make when he be doing this? <laughs> right. Can you imagine a little girl like that? Daddy, I dunked on him. <laughs> anyway. Baby, what happened I dunked on him. <laughs> <laughs> Baby, what happened to your hairline? Right. Daddy, I left the team again. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> I'm fucking say shit. I know LeBron's sensitive. If he hear this shit, he'll never speak to me. He'll see me. I'll be hey, what's up, LeBron? He'll be like, mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, <Stop>. <laughs> 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 he'll act like his leg is hurt and walk oh, away. Oh my! God. I think about the people I said slick shit about that I ain't mean no harm. I like I said shit about Kanye West. Oh, you um, talked about all kind of. Who you talking about? You think? My God, who this is a fifty-one fifty show. Yeah, he I can't mean. help it. He who I say something about? You talk everybody. about everybody. Talking about Venus had a weird walk. You followed her on Sunset. One I time. did. She had a weird walk. You yeah. said she looked like Eddie Kane. <laughs> wow, I didn't See? mean that. <laughs> Venus, for what it's worth, if nobody found out about it. <laughs> See? If nobody See? found out about what? what? I don't have to finish what I got to say. <laughs> yeah, you oh do. You just put your own conclusion right there. <laughs> uh, Venus is bad. If it was going to yeah. be our secret and I knew it, Venus. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway. That's my way of apologizing. Oh, we got I don't... another one. Oh, we got one more. Let's go. We got All another right. girl yep. on the line? Mm-hmm. Let's hit this other train wreck story. Shut uh, up. Uh, boy, here we go. All right, I'm fucking with you. Yeah. Hello? Oh. It's a dude. You hanging up. No, well, wait, what is he? Maybe he, he needs help. <laughs> Darlene wants to talk to him. Hey, Hello. what's All up, right. bro? So the, so the topic is how do you keep a man, right? Yeah. I, I'm going to say it like this. The topic is how do you keep a man a, as a woman? I'm going to say this. Be yourself if you good. If you're a good woman, be yourself. But if you ain't shit, shut your fucking mouth. <laughs> keep quiet and do as the man says. I agree with that. And <laughs> get my <laughs> fucking <laughs> dinner. This nigga is no, drunk off Paul no. Masson. Yeah. <laughs> it's that old school shit right here. I'll <laughs> tell you something else. When Boone I come farm. home. Okay, Archie. <laughs> you wanna, okay, Archie. You want to be a good woman? This nigga you got make ripple. sure I got a fucking beer in my hand at all times, bitch. Oh, my God. Hello? Yeah. We got another one? Oh, I thought Call you your woman that. Meathead. <laughs> Are we off that call? He was gangster. Right. Goodness. No, sake. but I agree with what he said. Yeah, you right. Shut your I fucking agree. mouth. You hear me? Good woman. <laughs> you do yourself. To the moon. That's right. That's shut your up. fucking mouth. Anyway. <laughs> oh, I love. That call. Yeah. Um, I. I. You, How did the dude know? get in? You screening the calls, man. That was Chris' it. uncle, man. He, <laughs> he call up here, I'm gonna let you through, Unc. I'm gonna let you through, Unc. Go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna do my like Italian voice. Go. Oh, shit! This motherfucker. Hello. His phone is ringing. The gayest tone and shit, like an '80s love song and shit. There it is. Hello. Hall of Notes, man. Turn your phone off. We have like a feedback, Chris. Is that a feedback? Here. Oh, it's. The- Turn Who's computer? computer? Hello. Oh, hey. wow! There's a girl. All right. Out of the out of the mist of noise comes a female How voice. How are you? Hello. 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 Yes. What's your name and where are you calling from? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Is she there? Hello. There yes. Hey, we hear? hear you. I know how to make a sound. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, ma'am. Uh-oh. What's your name and where you calling from? Hi, this is Queen. Okay, Queen. Where are you calling from? 
Texas. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Texas is big as hell. <laughs> <laughs> I'm calling for him. Uh, that shit was Texas. hella obvious. Texas is big as hell. Oh, this I'm is a young Texas. girl. Don't be like uh, that. <laughs> I'm calling from Texas. Okay. From Texas, what part Texas. of Texas do you live in, honey? The panhandle? <laughs> Are you calling from the panhandle of Texas? <laughs> Are you on a horse? Washington, Texas. All right, then. That's all we wanted to know. Now, go on and what, what? We got to talk to her like a Texan. You hungry? Sure. <laughs> How you doing? Take and put like I can. I'm, I'm listening to y'all, and I'm also listening to y'all on the computer. So y'all are like coming in so different. All oh. right, now this okay. You got to turn off. The hell you got to turn computer. the volume off on your computer. Yeah, she has you, to turn the volume down on the computer. Turn it down. Oh, okay, yeah. talk to us live. Come on, Texan. There you go, Mama. All right, what's up? La la Kiki. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, Mama. Yeah, we can hear you. All right, so listen, do you have a man? Oh, her computer. You still ain't turned your volume off. Come on now, follow instructions. Okay. There we go. Do you have a man, Missy? I do. I do have a good man. All right. Well, congratulations. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is he a Texan? <laughs> You guys are so dumb. Is he a Texan is the question. Okay. Um, about the subject. All right. Go ahead. I think a lot of women um, go at the men that they are kind of used to. Like a lot of women uh, don't really look for a good man because that's not what they used to seeing where I'm from. Hmm. And I think a lot of women look up to their mother and the men that their mother used to date and bring to the house. Mm. Oh. A lot of, and there, there are very few women I hear that do realize that they fucked up in a lot of relationships. But a lot of women uh, don't don't see because they don't really uh, it doesn't come to their attention by a good man. The man that I'm with has opened my eyes to a lot of things. Mm. That you know, what I'm saying and watching this show actually lets you realize, like, damn, I know some crazy shit. Cause Corey is so blunt <laughs> that you know, what yeah. I'm saying, you, if you're not real with yourself, you're not going to be able to hang with it. If you're not going to be able to understand it, but real recognize real. Mm. There it is. There it yeah. is. God I like this young lady right here. I'm telling yeah. you, I yes, like it. She's a Texan. Straight from the hip. I want you to enjoy your man. I want, <laughs> I want you to give your man some of that dang nabbit tonight, all right? That dang nabbit? That dang nabbit. <laughs> give it to him. Some of that damn nabbit. That damn nabbit. Dang nabbit. <laughs> hey, thanks for the call, baby. She was really yeah, insightful. Yeah, she was nice. Yeah, she, she, by her being man. young, I didn't yeah. know where it was going to go, but I was like, Shit. She, but I already know this anyway. Yeah. There are a lot of women out here who are not stupid and they know what it is. Even mm -hmm. if they do wrong, they know what it is. Mm -hmm. They'll be like, it's me. I fucked up. That's what I did. Now, mm -hmm. fuck it. What's next? What's next? Send the next sucker. I'm right. do it again. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, that's Send the next. Give it a try again. People who tell the truth and are comfortable in their skin, mm -hmm. those are people you can be in some type of honest relationship with. Mm -hmm. that's real. So only ladies call in. I mean, we're getting some really good callers. Yeah. Uh, you know, th what was the last sister's name? Queen. Queen. Queen, Queen from Texas. Texas. We got uh, the 40 year old Harmony. sister. Harmony. No, Harmony is 32. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I mean, we're getting some good callers. So call in and share your story. Zo gonna get your number off Chris Vaughn and be calling y'all. Hi. Hi, this is a follow up call. <laughs> <for Zoe. laughs> is everything all right? Are you, are you still are you with wearing? your man? No, this, is, this is Zoe game. I think you're beautiful. <laughs> That's my game. <laughs> Telling so, you. No, but I'm just saying, beautiful. I can see you on a date with a girl. Like, you are lovely. Hey, we've shown book some read. pictures <laughs> up here mm -hmm. over many shows of different women that were very beautiful. Yeah. Who's ugly, Zoe? I don't say who's ugly. Uh, I just. <laughs> A few people I think are ugly. Who's ugly? Like a girl that people know. But you know what? I you think be Senator before you answer that, Zoe. CC Pounder is ugly. Oh, who is that? that? <laughs> Jesus, that sounds awful. That sounds hideous. CC She's an actress. Pounder? I think she's unattractive. Who is that? Uh, the girl who played Precious? Uh, 
When you said pounder, I just thought it was her. I'm just saying. <laughs> oh, I, don't know. God. I think attitude has pounder. a lot to do with that too, because I don't like attitudes. It makes people ugly to me. I don't yeah, care how aesthetically, true. you know, well so the put girl them that, um, So the girl that uh, Ocho Cinco here, but she's ugly. She was acting ugly in those demands. Now she supposedly got herself together. I think she hustling the Christian shit now. Aesthetic, well, not totally, but aesthetically, I think Evelyn Lozada is beautiful. We need to have some t-shirts to say her, hustling the Christian and shit. And she admitted it. But see, she admitted it that yeah, that attitude. She was ashamed of herself how she conducted herself on that show. Yeah, she wrote a, a letter to herself. Yeah, she apologized like her eight. She wrote self. a letter to herself. How right. vain is that? Well, and they printed it. It was kind of like a whatever. It was a self. Bitch. It was a no. self-reflective letter. It was. It was. Good. I wonder she how many up women to a lot of shit. Ocho Cinco has head butt. <laughs> oh, that, well, that lady. We got another one. She another looks one. like wow, like, like Bill Duke see. in drag. <laughs> right. Oh, stop. Now I know that now, actress. Bo- now Zoe doesn't. Oh, you don't oh, think she's attractive? She's huh? nice. I no. like her as an actress. I think she's an incredible actress. Oh, that bitch looks like old boy who played fish on Barney Miller. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. She right, looked just like him. I mean, he asked if I thought. You know I'm right. right. No, you're, I just don't think she was. Everybody shy. look up CC Pounder <laughs> and then put a picture of her next to Fish from Barney Miller. It's the same person. Uh, it out. Anyway, Damn. hello, caller. Hello. Hello. Hey. Hello. Hi. Hey. Hi. Hey. <laughs> I hear a lot of voices at the same time. Oh. Good evening, or rather, good morning, 50 family. Hey, good morning. How are you? I love it. It's working. Let me tell you something. I, I, I pick up on vibrancy in a yes. woman. Like, some women are like, hi. <laughs> You're like, who is this? This is this, like, how are you, 5150 family? Yeah. Like, right. You'd be coming home from work smiling, dealing with somebody talking to you yeah. like that. Yeah. yeah. Spirit. Oh, that's an ugly picture. That's CC Pounder. God oh, damn. Oh, stop. Here they go in. But anyway, damn. who are we talking to? <laughs> Caller? My name is Tara, I'm 45, and I'm from Queens, New York. That's what up? Yeah. Queen. Yeah. Grown woman business right See here. the grown women represent. They I like that. That's what's yeah. up. Tell us three things you did to run a man but, but off. She, but let, before she go there, let me ask her. Uh-oh. Do you have a man? I don't have a man. Okay. I, I have this someone I'm seeing every now and then. I heard that. For that dad nabbit, as you right. know. Right. Nice. Little tuna. Pop, <laughs> pop through dick. <laughs> pop through <Jeez>. dick. <laughs> but I don't have one. I, I wish that I did. I'm actually in the process of a divorce. Oh. Oh. Yeah, but I've, we've been separated for about, unfortunately, like eight years. Ooh. Mm. And I was taking so long to do right. this paperwork. Mm-hmm. Just laziness. But, I heard that. Uh, Oh. I'm by myself right now, so and mm-hmm. as far as how to keep a man, honestly, I'm not even sure. Mm-hmm. I love the yeah, honesty, see? man. That's what I'm yeah. saying. It's Damn. like when you're talking to somebody who is talking real, and, 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 wow. and it's like she says she don't know how. And you mm-hmm. know what? Let me tell you something. I don't think there is a know-how formula. Right. There's, right. Not, there's not a complete nah. answer to that. There's right. Not right. A, right. A for sure. You just have to be me. wise with who you got up and under I you. Feel like there's so many choices out there for men. That That's true too. Mm. Even though I feel like this, this person that I'm hanging with now, I think he has so many choices anyway. So I'm trying to think, what is it about me that? He would prefer to be with me over that other person. Can you send a picture of your mouth? That's what I was just... Oh. Him being able to have a choice of somebody in their 20s. Oh, how old is he? It's, it's, it's interesting. <laughs> He's in his 20s. No, how old is the fella? She's, she's, Hello? I can yeah. hear you. No, we're asking how old is the guy you're dating? Hello? Yeah, how old is the guy that you're seeing? Uh-oh, what happened? I can't hear Uh-oh. Hello? No, we got you. We have, Stay I can right hear there. You. I can, she, but we she can can't hear, hear us. Hello? Uh oh. Hey? Hello. You still yeah. there? We can hear you clearly. Let me see. Let me, this, this, Aww. Maybe this is how you can tell if she, you. Could, if she can hear us. Hey, what that pussy look like? Nope, she can't hear us. Because <laughs> she was like, oh my God. She said hello again. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mommy, we lost her. You sucked that dick. I don't know what girl. happened. <laughs> I can't hear you guys. We can hear you, though. That pussy fat wet. Can you see us? <laughs> Yeah, we can hear yeah. you. We yeah. can hear you. She can't hear you talking. That's why I'm fucking Maybe with her. Maybe your phone is on mute. Maybe Uh-oh. you hit the Did mute. Did you hit mute? You. Uh-oh, we can hear her. She hit the mute button. Oh, she man. probably got the fat cheeks. I don't cheeks. want to hang up, but I can hardly hear you guys. She can hardly. Let me take these socks off. Stop. And put on your lip. Oh, my God. <laughs> she can't hear us because she would have left. There you go. Can you hear us now? <laughs> 
No. Mm, oh, mama, we're going to have to let her go. Dang it. Put some magic shave on that pussy. All right. Jam. <laughs> oh shoot, we lost her. All right, don't Dang torture. It. We love you, sister. I oh, know. We love Thanks you, sister. I'm fucking with you. I knew you. I knew you couldn't hear us when I uh. said that stupid shit. <laughs> I heard you got a hamster in your ass. Anyway, oh, all the best of luck to you, girl. Oh, she's she sounds like she all right. That's what I'm saying. What See, want. it's okay. Well, she said right. that she doesn't know why he want her. Oh, that dude. Why yeah, that. Yeah, that's the sign She's just of, saying there's so many choices for men. There's not a lot of choices, God damn it. These dudes minute. out here. For um, guys, there's a lot of choices. I mean. No, there's not a lot of choices no, there's because not there's not chicken. many good people in the world. There now, you there's go. a lot of meat yeah. out there. there a lot you of go, meat. Yeah. You can just. <laughs> what the Jesus, fuck? Sounds, man. What? That's good sex sound. When you hear that oh, shit. <laughs> when you hear that. <laughs> What the fuck is going on? Y'all ain't had no good sex, boy. <laughs> anyway, who we got on the line now? They good sex. Chris from Philly, no relation. Chris, Chris from Philly, Philly no, relation. no relation. What's up, Chris? What do you got to say on this? What you got to, uh... I got to say, uh... I can't believe I'm on right now. Like, oh. I darling, hey, you're the biggest shit. You know what? Stop, Chris. <laughs> He's terrible. <laughs> What's up, Chris? Okay, nigga. You got your turn. Let's go. Oh, what? Exactly, nigga. Oh, oh that my shit. God. Right. He accidentally hung up. Women call in, damn it. What's the drop this cheese We don't have the shit yeah. set up right when it's works. No, but A lot that was of women good, though, are talking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of times they can't hear us. We can't hear them. That's While they talking, we... Doop, doop, another phone coming <laughs> through. <laughs> this is the boot. This shit look bootleg than a motherfucker. That's because it's 5150. Yeah. Shit's supposed to be crazy. It could be right. bootleg, <laughs> but I'm like... <laughs> <laughs> right. Hello, caller. Oh, uh, yes. This is your parole officer. <laughs> <laughs> We're waiting for you to get it's a line. Just, uh-huh. It's just shit to interfere. Like when you be telling a girl, girl, I ain't fucking with nobody but you, and your phone be like, mm. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it's two in the morning. Mm. You the only motherfucker mm. I fuck with. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Yeah. Man, I got that motherfucker on silent, but that buzzer on some bullshit. Mm. <laughs> answer that motherfucker is oh, over. No, that's, that's Go on answer. Look, that how about we say, Go ahead, answer it. Why aren't you answering it? Go on, answer it. Don't oh, tell stupid. me to answer it, because I answer that motherfucker and put it on speaker. Uh oh. Hello? Be like, yeah, hey, who did? You know the fuck they did? <laughs> <laughs> You told me you gonna be over here about that. <laughs> All right, well, I'm with this other bitch. Say hi, bitch. You're right. You're right. Who the fuck is that, Corey? No, oh my God, that's too much. There's one I more mean, there. Like if, is right. it a girl? We'll see. Find out if it's like, a girl. You gotta screen the calls, man. Yeah, we ain't trying screen. to hate oh, on there my you go. niggas. Gonna take it. Just, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh-huh. That's a girl, huh? That's a girl. I can tell All by right. the way you said that. Oh, he did. She said, "Yeah, it was a girl." <laughs> <laughs> God damn! Hello. Hey. Oh, Chris got to put the there. They on. go. Okay, I heard it. There you go. No? Uh-huh. Hello. Your name and where are you calling from? I'm calling from North Carolina. North Carolina. <laughs> NC up in the building. <laughs> like a helicopter. Yes, I'm calling from North Carolina. I love your show. All right. And we I love. I always see you guys every week, and I just want to say honestly, I'm a 36 year old female. Nice. Uh, not never been married. Okay. Oh, okay. Are you from North Carolina? Uh, no, I'm not. Are you from Belize? I'm from the island, so tell Free that I appreciate his um, invitation. Ah, Jamaica. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Jamaica. Yeah. Yeah. What's, yeah, What's happening? Y'all could probably talk together. Uh-huh. You like trouble. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> But no, I just called to say that, um, you know, I agree on most of the stuff Corey says each week. Um, I know that a lot of my friends, they are professional women. They've been to college. They have their masters. But I noticed that they're, um, they're kind of settling for just any old kind of man because they feel like maybe their standards are a little bit too high. Mm-hmm. So it's just like, no, it's like, man, I just want to get a man just to 
say I have a man, mm. but they feel like they're being left out of the game. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's deep. So, yeah, so I don't know. I guess the question would be not only how to keep a man, but where to find a decent man. Because if, if they're like me, who live in a small town in North Carolina in the country, mm. all you're going to have is a bunch of old men pinching your butt. <laughs> <laughs> there's not a lot of places to go and find a different kind of people. So I don't know how you guys. This what you have to do. This what you have to do. You have to go down to the construction site. <laughs> you understand? <laughs> yeah, you have, to, you have to bring a big pot of doubles <laughs> and some some uh, some uh, ackee and a salt fish and a big big bowl of porridge. And you say, now look here. <laughs> Which one of you man gonna put down the hammer and come bang this poom poom now? <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee you get a good man. Oh, please. advice to me. That's right. Oh, yeah. Man. Thanks for calling, sister. That's I love the show, guys. I really do. I enjoy it. And um, keep up the good work. But Get off of your find something better. Okay. All right. All right. Thank, Thank you, sister. Thank you. And good luck out there. You know, she's a little cool, man. Hang in there. Porridge and poom poom. That'll wow. get him. <laughs> wow. I want to say this about this internet thing. We, 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 we're supposed to have some type of solution coming that we're checking on. Um, they, 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 they just want to charge a lot of money for internet. Mm. Like, uh, how much was it, Chris? 180 a month for internet because just, we're just the internet service, because just we're the internet. using the mics and everything. Mm. They hustle they hustle you in every way. They're sitting somebody is sitting somewhere and just to be able to talk on the mic 180 a month. Mm. That's cold blooded. Eh? Bastards. That's some cold shit. Mm -hmm. It's some cold blooded dirty What are you shit. using the internet for? Right. Do you have mics? Are you trying? Are you trying to come out of the norm? Uh, are you broadcasting? You're doing a lot more yeah. than surfing. <laughs> <laughs> the bandwidth is crazy on this end. What are you guys doing over there? <laughs> well, we're gonna have Jerry Swice and Ray Kugel come over there and check out your equipment. <laughs> what? Jerry, what, what about Swice? the Jamaican operator when you call and trying to oh, get your no. your cable done right? Well, <laughs> first of all, first of all, you have to check your attitude. <laughs> Please do not call me with, unless you have a precise example of what you are complaining about. <laughs> <laughs> you can't just pick a random problem. <laughs> it's a lot of people on the line have a big problem, bigger problem than you. What about the Chinese <laughs> tech? Oh, uh -oh. yeah. First of all, you have to, you have to look, look, on the, look on the preliminary. <laughs> You have to go back the to, to the preliminary. You know, look at the preliminary and tell you <laughs> you're a fucker up. You don't put the right connection. <laughs> you're having too much uh, bandwidth. <laughs> you have to go maybe, maybe a little tiny bandwidth for you. <laughs> Talking on the same mic. <laughs> Talking on the same mic, yeah. Maybe all of you can get in one line. <laughs> and then look over your shoulder. You say one line on this shoulder, that shoulder. Then that way you have one mic. You know what I'm saying? Oh the cheap. Save your money. <laughs> <sighs> I love it. Freeze <sighs> love, man. I love freeze, it. That's God. great. Yeah. Oh, my God. That motherfucker. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I have a lot of friends all over. <laughs> we, we all smoke a weed together. I listen to them. Did talk. you say all over? All over the whole world. All over. All over. All yeah. over the uh, over. Anyway. Oh man. Oh, okay. Well. Well. I, I'll say this. I'll say this. Hmm. Um, I don't blame somebody for being in a bad relationship altogether. It's not one person's fault. It's both of you fault. That's you cannot true. say. It's it's something that one person is doing because when you know better, you do better. Get the fuck away from a motherfucker that ain't gonna fuck with you for real. Mm. But getting away from a motherfucker ain't always the answer to the problem. Mm -hmm. The problem is you gonna have that same problem with the next motherfucker. Right. You see what I'm saying? You can't get away from yourself. You gotta fix yourself. Mm. Now if you fix yourself and it's still issues going on, hey, then maybe you can motherfucking be like, well, maybe I should... I should give up on this. But if you're still doing the same shit you yeah. was doing from back in the day, yeah. and you talk about what this motherfucker hate doing, I mean, I'm just saying, I don't right. know how you go get it together. And don't complain. If you're choosing to stay in a, in a particular relationship where you have all these problems and you keep complaining to your folks and your people around you about it, don't. And you're staying with it, 
Don't do it. Don't right. complain. Don't, don't just don't complain. It doesn't make any sense. I like Staying that. down mm-hmm. in it. And it's, also remember, a good relationship doesn't mean that you always got money. Everything is always sweet. Right. That's not a. That's not that's that. Not that's a good time during a relationship. Mm. Relationships are up and down. That's, right. That so sometimes it other, yeah. is is how you act. And yeah. and and mm-hmm. sometimes the downs actually so define the, most the relationship. Yeah. That's real. Mm-hmm. So if y'all down. And still down for each other. Now you got something. And it's I'm, easy to be down for your partner when shit is I'm good. Tell you Candy, this too. Play that song. Tell you this too. When you <laughs> out there looking for a man, you you want to see how a man's gonna treat you. See how he treats his family, his mother. That's right. right. Yeah. Yeah, that's real. Yeah. Respect yeah. To his mother. Hey, there's a, you you might get some respect there. Mm. Right. A he, relationship is worth fighting for if both of y'all. Are sleepy when you washing up at the sink. You don't want to let that go. <laughs> right. That means, that, that's, that's potential. So that's Hella so bonding right. moment right there. Mm. Hella bonding. We're sleepy and we're if you washing never, up in the sink. You ain't never together. sleepy while you washing up at the sink. That relationship ain't shit. <laughs> right. That's real. Yeah, yeah. We're bird bathing well, together. Go hoop after y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Let's bird bath together. This right. was extraordinary sex. <laughs> <laughs> this shit is crazy. Bird, bro. Uh-huh. I think next week's show should be sex right after somebody else left. Wait, nobody what? talks about that. <laughs> nobody talks about sex sloppy right after seconds. somebody else left. Wait, wait, right, sloppy seconds. Nobody admits. <laughs> nobody admits that their body parts have been used recently. Nobody admits it. Everybody is always shy. So how are you going to have a show about it? You're just going to have to have a bunch of horrors on here? That well, we, can loose, have loose people, we can have people who are willing to talk about. Ooh-hoo. But how would you know? Like, if the you go in a woman. That's what makes the you show like, so interesting. You is know, there a way to tell? Sticky? Like, what do you do? Is like, like, what do you know. tell me? Is, that, is there know? a way to tell if a woman has just had a guy left? No, because hey, wait a uh, is it, baby, wait a minute now. Why do you <laughs> smell like brute? <laughs> <laughs> Old spice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, like, is there a way to determine? Well, well yeah. how about this? How about this? Check it out. And uh, you tell me if you think I'm wrong. Everybody. Mm-hmm. Extra blue out? What is it? Yeah, but that Sometimes been when over when time. when you have been um ravaged. <laughs> You can't tell on the right. guys unless his balls are extra saggy. There's nothing in there. Well, okay, if that's the way you can tell. See, no, people don't know that. Mm. What I'm saying, sometimes girls, their their really? clit. Yeah, because you're all empty. Yeah. If you got a woman whose clit, they're not hard and all. Is sensitive, sporty. <laughs> and you can get that motherfucker to. You can get it to go off. <laughs> if you get, if, if you can make a woman come, you know, with her clit, <laughs> then. Okay, but then sometime you'll see her and you'll be like, God damn, baby, this motherfucker. Oh, oh God. What the fuck? What you been doing to this motherfucker? God. What, is that wrong? I'm going to tie a string to it and tie it other end to the door and slam it. If you don't come, something's going on. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. <laughs> yeah, you just damaged it. What the hell? So he's saying if it's harder to make her come oh, this is, this is his than thing. usual. Oh, then usual. So it's your girl. That's no. Different. I'm saying like the, if the clit has been tampered with, sometimes you can tell. You be or like, if the clit is red and sensitive and puffy. What if she Ooh. tampered with it herself? Uh-huh. That's true. Wow. Right. That's, yeah. that's yeah. normally the answer you that get. Is. Yeah. Well, well, I just I finished playing with myself. Yeah. Those, rabbits, those rabbits are better than a man's finger and tongue. So those rabbits. Yeah, that little vibration. Ooh, Lord, when you put the little nozzle and the little wings on the little guy. I heard about those, but Love girls it. are always shy to use them in front of guys. Oh, I don't know about that, but I'm just When saying. I was in college, I bought this girl. I was dealing with a rabbit, and she would not use it. God damn it. Scared. But, it's, it's, but it's scary. She would it's never so go anyplace without it. She no, one never day when it. I went over there, it was broke. And I was like, why is it broke? Oh, oh it sounded a little weird. <laughs> it <was> wore out. <laughs> that rabbit was like, this bitch put it ain't about shit. <laughs> I've been vibrating this motherfucker out. I know I'm going to get them hoes wrong quick. Nigga. I'm wrong with it, but not, not your bitch. <laughs> <laughs> the vibrator talking to you, nigga? Right. It's a trick rabbit. 
<laughs> Trick it on the bed. Oh, shit, man. This pussy smell like boy ski. Damn. Anyway, no, that wouldn't be, a, I don't think that'd be a very successful show, Corey, because it'd be just. Mm. Eucalyptus and bleach. <laughs> you can't tell. Everybody's Did different. Did you say eucalyptus? <laughs> and bleach. And bleach. Don't worry about it. Anyway. So we got that actress in because I was very shocked to see her face. Zoe has finally called a woman unattractive. You know what? <laughs> you know what? He just asked. That's the yeah. bitch that got burned on Face Off. Oh, Remember that movie yeah. Face Off? They had them all over there. I, know, I think she's very talented, man. Well, that's why they, yeah. You can't <laughs> clean it. <laughs> you can't clean it up. <laughs> now he's I like, think she's talented. She's an incredible yeah, actress. You just bitches. asked me who I thought was True. unattractive. No, that's all. So you saying yeah. Nipsey Russell is not attractive? <laughs> Rubber face? Wait, Nipsey who? Russell is dead. Rubber who face? are you talking about? Rubber face? Anybody with those. That's why I can't use rubber face. You know what I'm saying? It just looks like Slides rubber. Slides, boy. Oh, shit, <laughs> me. That's what that bitch look like. Nipsey Russell. A teeny. A teeny. A teeny. A teeny. That's fucked up. Uh, I just said she was on a drive. You don't have STP. Crisco would do just fine. Slides, <laughs> <laughs> <Slides>, boy. It wins, baby. That's <laughs> yeah, that was an ugly bitch, though. Oh, yeah. Lord. Anyway. See, if I see her in public, I tell her, this is all entertainment. You're not <laughs> ugly. Nobody's ugly in the yeah. eyes of the Lord. Oh, right. Lord. But in Corey's eyes, Jesus Lord, watch out. Jesus loves the little children. <laughs> Even the children the world. world. Red and yellow, black and white. He don't care if you're a dyke. Jesus. You know what? That's not a good song. <laughs> that ain't a song. I fucked the song up. I'm sorry. I got to look. You don't care if you're oh, a dyke. Oh, Lord. Jesus, that's the new one. That's 215. That's 2015. Fuck. Glory version. Lord Jesus. Now he's ruining it in fucking yes, gospel songs yes. now. Oh. Gospel ain't off limits to me. Oh, uh -oh, here it is. <laughs> Go kill him on the mountain. <laughs> Remember that commercial for the gospel records? They had just yeah. just the beginning of all the right. little birdie. It had all, right. the, <laughs> yeah. it had all the cold choir. Right. The Florida Mass choir. You keep on proving yourself to me. How right. do you remember all this stuff? Goodness well, sake. I, I watch old shit on the internet. Oh, right. Yes. Sometimes the shit I pop up the internet, look up and be like, you ain't think I had that shit, did you? <laughs> <laughs> I, I Google yeah. old shit. Clutch cargo one cartoons. More. We're going to take one more call to end the night. We're going to take another call. You got a girl? Uh-oh. Let's just let's see. Okay, hang right let's up. See. Pretty it's awkward, a, it's a mail. Hang right up. Hello? She got to turn the computer down, though. Turn your whole room down, sweetie. Turn the whole room down. <laughs> Say no, girl. Turn down the computer. Oh, oh, shit. What up, G? What's up? What's up? What's up? What up, man? 5150. 5150 Nation. What up, man? You good? What's up? Uh, just to kind of uh, speak on the topic, uh, a lot of times the real reason why a lot of women can't keep a man is because they programmed by the TV and media and magazine. And, uh, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? They being programmed into what to look for. And there's no guarantee that who they're looking for or who they're going after is a good dude or not. Mm. So they get stuck on the wrong shit. Man, I that's 100, that. dog. You yeah, had, that's have you that. had a experience? Have you experienced that before? Like you're a good dude and then you you know got upset because she didn't really see it? Or are you taken? You got a girl? Hello? Ah, boo! We lost him. But that yeah, hung that up on all Darlene little interview questions. He was like, "Get the fuck out of here!" Shut up. <laughs> 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 fuck is you trying to talk to? No, I'm just no, because he was like, "I, I thought what he said was on point, though." Mm -hmm. I thought what he said was on point. Sure, it's true. It's Girls true. who are programmed by the television and shit. Well, that other girl said it yeah. earlier. Call. She said uh, they're not used to it. They're they're used to seeing what's around them, the neighborhood, their parents, their family, their aunties. They're bringing these dudes around, and they think that's what they need to look for. All I'm saying is, if a woman was just like, "Where would I find a good man?" I honestly don't know where to tell her to look for a good man. Yeah, just what do you look for a good man? You don't just like what look. would you send you your sister? What what do you do? 
You just go go out there, attend a lot of things, go to social gatherings, parties. Just tell your sister or whoever you love the truth. Look, you got to get that pussy woe out out there in them streets. Look, I, and I the best you. one out of them, that's the one you be with. Look, that's what you're going to tell your daughter and your your mom and all what that. What do you tell them? I'm asking. Is it your mom single? What would you, you tell your mom, You bring them all Corey? to dad. You bring huh? them to me and I'll tell you if he's good or not. Bring him to you. You Bring tell him, him he's good. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm going to tell you something. Take him out hang out with him a when he's punk happens. ass tie ain't impressive, nigga. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Better on his, uh, at least one pair of dickies. Some oh. khakis. No, oh, but I wardrobe. think meeting <laughs> meeting the dude your daughter is dealing with is is par for the course. If you're a father, if you're an active father, you got to meet that dude. The best. And you got to check oh, him out. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. You know. Oh, good. No, I was just going to say the best chance that you have, like if I was seriously going to send my daughter out in this world and tell her what she will find a man who is serious Mm. about their time together, serious about his relationship with her, it would be at Cancer Institute of America. Those guys ain't got time to bullshit up there. Listen, they are listen. serious That's about hilarious. doing something in this world. That's hilarious. Listen, listen. <laughs> enough of the small talk. Right. That, uh, <laughs> I love you, all right? right. <laughs> we don't have time to be out here playing. Holly got two days left. <laughs> right. <laughs> Bitch, I got to go get my hair cut. You know what? <laughs> anyway. Uh... What? Oh, no. 5150. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not, right, I'm not, I'm not rubbing that shit in because cancer is some real shit, God damn it. Cancer. Chances real, are, real, exactly. motherfuckers, yeah, uh-huh. right out of this table, what is this, five people? Somebody go get that shit. Yeah. You know what, That's is that good. how he gonna go? Or well, they've had it. Well, they've had it? Yeah. I can't say. They've dealt with it, yeah. Yeah. Chris got tongue cancer. Shut up, my God. I thought it was jaw cancer. <laughs> Here we no, go, boy. Tongue. They scraped his jaw and they cra- scraped his tongue. They was like, there's more shit on his tongue than the jaw. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> what? Here we go. But no, for real, Corey, what the would you tell The Foxhole Boys like it? Here we go. Put uh, that hot shit on this thing. Uh, oh, that's I got my Foxhole joke in. Hmm. This is like, oh, <laughs> as you threw me under the bus. I got a fox home points. That's it, right? I ain't forget that, dude. All right, my bad. We'll fuck it. Anyway. I'm sorry. All right. Shit. We're out of time. We're out of time. Look, I want to say this, goddammit. As you see, I am sporting, goddammit, the 5150 yeah. Nation red shirts, you dig? And some little old shorts. That they can't they see on them. the site. <laughs> I got on some shorts. My shorts ain't too little. It's I don't just, know. I'm seeing a lot of leg I know, over I, here. I know the way I'm real long. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I looked down. I was like, it's a lot of meat over he here. He was looking at my legs the whole show. I just was playing it off. I was like, yeah. I was like, does he have pants on? Looking at this thing over oh here. Oh, God. Yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> you can't miss it. His legs all. 5150 Nation shirts at CoreyHolcomb.com. <laughs> Hey, look, I, I just want to say this. <laughs> 5150 Nation, thank you. You have helped me help myself as you patronize my business with my T-shirts. Um, we'll have these on the site. We'll have to practice safe sex on the site real soon. I just wanted to plug that. Anybody else got something they want to plug? Of course, Cleveland. You know I'll be at the State Theater Saturday. We're going to act a motherfucking fool. Me, D.C. Curry, J. Anthony Brown and Dion Cole, it's on. I'm going to act a motherfucking fool. Was, we couldn't tell. The picture was blurry. Oh, yeah, we're going to act a motherfucking fool. That's, that's going to be a big that's show. Gonna be yeah, yeah. Big yeah. show. That's what's up. Mm-hmm. Oh, so we've only got 225 copies remaining of The Relationship Dismount, my new book on relationship. We were, ironically, we were talking about a lot of what's in that book already. Mm, see? Um, again, if you want a, a paperback version of the book you just got to go to my website i am zoewilliams.com mm-hmm. and purchase it uh we'll we'll ship it out to you asap and then also for those of you who have a uh, android cell phones uh the zoe williams app is available on google play it's a free app it contains everything that i'm doing radio shows live streaming of the shows all of that stuff is on there you can buy the book from there you can just connect through everything that i'm doing google play zoe williams app you search on there it's zoe williams one word no space you'll find it new app 
Yeah, and also download my free app, the Freeze Love app. It's F R E E Z L U V, and it's a free app. Uh, you can get it from iTunes. You can get it from Google Play. Nice. So download it, laugh, and enjoy. <laughs> I want to say to all you guys who got raped in jail, that shit. Let me tell you something. Once you get out, it's a new start. Don't don't even think about that shit no more. Let it go. They can't hurt you no more. <laughs> so damn kind of you, Corey. They already got it up. There. They already got it up. Jeez, Louises, man. Boy, they cold. <laughs> 5150 cold. 50 cold, boy. The 5150 Nation, man. Uh, don't play. Fish. Don't I used play. to love that shit. <laughs> right. That was a good show. That's you right. said it. I knew exactly who you meant. Damn. Thanks again for everybody from the 5150 Nation who Thank has you. supported the relationship dismount to this point. I, I appreciate everybody. Thanks. To all you girls out there who are pregnant by a stranger, I want you to know that even if you keep this baby, your life going to be fucked up. But let me tell you something. You can make the best out that fucked up life. You and your baby can grow into a strong bond, and y'all can help each other as you are both bad decision makers. Ah, oh, there it is. The baby, too? Yeah, the baby, he came. <laughs> Words. He had to come out that dark world. Corinthians. I, just, I always say positive fucked up stuff. Okay. <laughs> Positive, hooked up stuff. Oh, I want to say to everybody out there on crack, it could be worse. You could be on heroin. Crack is a blessing. <laughs> Ain't this nothing. Don't believe him? Ask a meth head. It's <laughs> oh, oh, a blessing. It's a blessing. I can't chew gum anymore. Oh, <laughs> wow. Yeah. Meth head. Anyway. I want to let you know if the band in your ass has been broken <laughs> Through due to truffle butter play. I want you to know your shit may not stay inside you, but the good is still inside you. Do the good thing, do the right thing. Because your ass is blew out from doing the bad thing. You got that public service announcement, boys. Ain't this a bitch saying that stuff? Boy. Just saying fucked up shit. God if damn. the band is broken. If right. your band is <laughs> Yeah, a lot That's of guys bad. get their band broken and then the doctor come in there and be like, I can't do nothing with that motherfucker. Wow. You better pour some motherfucking... Um, Chalk it up in the loss. Pour some lemon juice on your ass. <laughs> right. Boy, I don't know what it tastes like. That ass look like apple a loose cider. sandwich. <laughs> you just choke your ass in apple cider vinegar. <laughs> <laughs> Draw your ass up again. God damn damn it. It. You need your ass to do this. Anyway. Put, oh. some, put some bitter shit on your ass. <laughs> You should, you should you should sit your ass down on a, on an unripe persimmon. <laughs> what the hell? I don't even know what it is, but I'm laughing. I do. I know what that is. I'm gonna start giving more All public right. service announcement advice. Goddamn. Goddamn. That's nice, Corey. Throughout the show, I like that. It's right. very considerate of you. It's gonna be the new shit. Public service mm. announcement. Anyway, All we're right. gonna wrap this shit up. Fifty one fifty nation. Thank y'all for fucking with us. Yeah. I'll be back. <laughs> We got to get some real phones in this motherfucker. All right. That was fun, though. I like nice. the movie. Yeah. I like the dude. We out here. You kind of like that, huh? Yeah, <laughs> that's it. It's fun.